Yo, what up, podcast people? Listen, one on your Yo, what up, winning. podcast people? <laughs> Yo, what up, podcast people? Yeah, you remember you a bitch now. Because Who? What? At the start Damn. of the podcast, John? Yeah, yeah. We got to promote the, the Patreon. Oh, oh, see why he a bitch. <laughs> oh, oh, Caleb wow. said I have the right. Yeah, Caleb said I had the right. Yeah, he might demonetize team, the whole team. thing. I'm about to say the whole, the whole podcast is going to be demonetized <laughs> just to push Patreon, yo. <clears throat> what up, podcast people? It's the one only legend of winning, a.k.a. Low. We do another episode Wrong. of the Peer to Peer Podcast. A.k.a. Bitch. Damn. Come on, what right? is going on right <laughs> now? Man? I mean, he's not wrong. I'm not wrong. He okay. didn't have to say it. Okay, I'm not wrong. All right, all right, all right. calm down, calm down, guys. Um, on my left, I have my co-host, Agent Zero. Say what up? Hey, welcome. You know what happened? I was at the bank in South Carolina trying to get mm. my twenty thousand. TD Bank has been holding hostage for four years. Take a look at what happened, man. I told this guy, "We can run me my money, man." And, and he said, well, "What's your YouTube name?" And we just got into the YouTube talk. I mean, he was rizzing me up low key. I didn't gave him my name, right? right. I didn't gave him my what? name. And then after that, he, he called me when I was on my way back. I was like, did I forget something? He's like, you know, I told my daughter about your your, your name. And she's like, she watches the podcast. And I was like, wow. Uh, I wonder why. Yeah, wow. I wonder why. It's probably what does the daughter look like? I, do you think I got that info see, over the phone? that's what we need. I need a ring light. We don't even know. I need a ring light so they can see my melanin. I look a little dark back here. Yeah, you All do. My, you just turn up the You just turn up the light You just turn up the ISO, though. Huh? I, just, I need a ring light. Like I feel like I need to be. I need to look like TikTok. Eat, eat thought. Also, his daughter could be. Are we even sure his daughter was of age? I don't care. I, it was just a no, story. He just asked. He asked, "What did she look like?" I don't so want her. Like 60, I didn't want her to so like, oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay but hopefully, yeah. he's not watching. He's about to be upset at y'all. He be like, "This is what she Wait, watches." He gave y'all. He, he gave you twenty bands yet? Some of his daughter's business. He gave you twenty bands yet? Yeah, I got my money. Fuck him. Okay. You got your money. Actually, let me check my account. Yeah, yeah, we'll check. Make sure he's not Respectfully. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Respectfully <laughs> holding my 20 bands. That's yeah, crazy. Make sure you got your good cards to wish for his daughter. While well, uh, Agent checks his, his 20 bands, uh, John, any any uh, any opening statements? Uh, you know, um, I was talking to a girl last night about the fans, and we were talking about she was selling her draws. And she oh, was like, the draws, the draws she got to peel off go for more than the regular draws. Just what? Like that. That's what do you food mean for thought. peel off? Food for thought. What do you mean peel off, though? What do you think I mean, Shaq? It's like a latch on the side that just... Nah. No, she's talking about peel I got off my bread, her. Fellas. Day, you pull, said my, I'm, yes, I've had them all yes, day sir. and she peeled them off her. Yeah. No, that's disgusting. I mean, yep. if she is musty. You huh? can peel... I don't want to know. Yeah, just mm. think about it in your head. It's food for thought. So that means she's... Sweaty. She's either she's sweaty or she's climaxing in them, and then she peels them off and sells them. Yeah, discharge, discharge. It's Don't all no, day. not discharge. <laughs> Fuck no, discharge has something to do with STDs, nigga. No, not all the time. What are you talking about? Or what else? What else? Like I've heard that discharge, regularly, girls. I like, thought discharge like, regular. I've, I've seen posts where girls post like their panties at the end of the day, and it'll be clean, and the girls is like, that's not normal. Like they normally they they have like. Hey, so <laughs> whoa, no, I no, no, no I ain't clean never. Clean are not normal. Huh? Nigga, I live clean with a woman right now. No, I live with a woman right now, and I've never seen that. No, not like color discharge. Like color discharge is crazy, but like anything that comes out of your body is discharge. That's true. Yeah, like, I guess. You know what I'm saying? Like if she's like wet, she's there's discharge. There's oh, but well, okay, 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 okay. It's a different, different uh, terminology. Term. Oh, different, different terminology. Uh, okay, when I just when people say discharge, Sorry, I'm, I'm a rookie. Thinking like as as thinking about burning. I'm Burn talking about STDs. That's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about oven. No, three fifty. I'm talking about yeast infections. Yeah. Yo, um, and also we got a special guest here, Shaq. What up? What up, man? What up? I'm all right, man. You know, I prepared myself for this. I've been watching you guys' podcasts all the time. Mm, so good. I, I, I heard John likes attractive thirteen year olds, and um, <laughs> Ooh, I keep forgetting you did say that. Yo, bro. Every time I scroll through the TikTok, man, it, that video keeps popping back up. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, no, that's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> it, it, it's not even like that. It's yeah, every it's time crazy. I say something, even on stream, <laughs> nobody thinks straight anymore. Every time I say something, niggas' mind goes straight to sweetness, <laughs> the sweet Tavius. But you said attractive 13 year olds. No, John. but I'm saying yeah, the, the, the correlation was crazy because you went from cute, no, you went from adorable to cute but to attractive. That's how the ages work. So you don't call a, <laughs> you don't call a baby fine. Only a ba- if a baby. But you don't call a thirteen year old attractive, John. But that's what thirteen year olds will call each hey, other. John, you might have to take. <laughs> John, stop, stop. Uh, we know what you meant. It's just the way you deliver it, man. Yeah. Hey, it's the way you deliver it. You know, there's millions of niggas. Where you see that. 
<laughs> Wait till they hit a Patreon. No, they, they told me I can stay wherever I want on Patreon. Know, the Patreon we just uploaded. The Patreon we just got done recording yesterday. Mostly I didn't have to watch my mouth at all. It's yeah, crazy. It got the bad. shit that we caught on camera is crazy. Um, but uh, um, just quick housekeeping. Shout out to my audio p- people out there. Google Play, Stitcher, Spotify, Apple Podcasts. Also shout out to my YouTube people as well. Clips channel going crazy. So if you don't like to listen to the whole hour, hour and a half, maybe even two hour pod, go click the link in the description because it'll swing you over to the clips. Also, like we just said before, there's some uncut, uncensored content on Patreon as well. That that nice, juicy, juicy stuff that you really want to hear. Mm. And also, man, hit the subscribe button. Why does he sell it like that? That type of well, peel off type of content. <laughs> that all day <laughs> type of content. No, 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 no. Wedgie content. <laughs> Why is that? Do you find, oh, real, just I'll say this real quick. Shout out to um, all my people who hit the subscribe button and notification bell so they can join. You know the gang, 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 hey! gang. Yeah, no I'm playing, man. I'm too with I, I, I support. I support. I, 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 I support. I, 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 I was trying to. The whole time you talking, I'm ahead. I'm like, when do I say it? When do I say it? When do I say it? I was hoping you pull up. I know, me too. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna be the first like heavyweight battle. Yeah, yeah. That would have been a good one in the basement heavyweight battle in the dark. Yeah, no. If you got it wrong, you'd have to go one on one in the dark. No, I'm a real supporter. I'm not a fake supporter. I'm not one of the guests that come here and they don't know what they're talking about. That's beautiful. For real. That is beautiful. And um, all my word to my people. So before we get into this, so y'all, do you find it attractive having women like just wear panties all day and they have discharge in it? No, nah. I think that's weird. I think it's really weird. I just know because I know some. Apparently, some men are because he just sat there and said that. I feel like that's she's weird. Yeah. Thing, she, I feel that's the weird price goes up too. on that. Like just to take these all day panties off. Put them in a Ziploc bag, send them to a nigga. Okay. And from the open the bag and sniff <laughs> Yeah. A nigga expected. Like, <laughs> Niggas checked in his tracking for That's some dirty so draws. That's lonely, though. That is lonely. That's Cause cause you're not doing that. Think about if a nigga could... expecting a package and his dirty draws. Damn. Relax. Imagine Mr. being the one who <laughs> delivers it. Think about, think about how mad. <laughs> Think about how mad a nigga is when he comes home to the little letter on the door that he missed the delivery. He, it's so important he want to sign for him because he don't want to be outside too long. Sign nigga, for signing for that is crazy. Sign for some sure drugs. Why no package? Just throw that shit on the fucking. Uh, but nah, you gotta sign for him. No, those are the ones you could throw from inside the vehicle. Yeah, just keep it pushing, dog. Yeah, facts. Nigga, Nick, somebody waiting for that is nasty. That's a nasty nigga. You Sometimes I'll, I'll be thinking I'll, I could be a bad bitch. Uh, what? What? Like I be thinking sometimes when I see how easy it is for girls to make money without doing nothing. I just that wish I could be a bad bitch. I can't be a bad bitch though. That's but do you crazy. know that comes with right? Huh? You're gonna have to fuck niggas, right? I don't have to. Yeah, you do. Some don't have to. But didn't you say if you was a bad bitch, you would fuck a lot of niggas? Oh, you I did, know, you did say that. Yeah. Yeah. Look, see, no. I do my research. Yeah, that's a juicy. Yeah. Yeah. You, yeah. you said yeah. you, you, you want to get dick. I, I, you want to get dick. You want to dick. The dick edition every other day, especially now that women make money off it the way they do. Look, bro, to the to the whores out there, I understand. I understand. Wait, what so you, why are you not like a whore right now? But you got titties and ass right now. Thing. You just a male. <laughs> Do you hear what, what he said? <laughs> he said you got titties and ass right now. You just a male. <laughs> you can live that dream if you I want can, to. I can't. I can't live that hard. I have titties too. That nigga's going crazy, bro. Yo, wait. You could do it right now though. Why you? Yeah, I'm in a relationship right now. And I'm niggas saying pay before for that, though, you could have done it. You never. You never did it. It's not that many. These women go out here spending money on dick. Ne- negotiate with T. Tell her it's for business. Take on trips with the money. That's crazy. This if this <laughs> yo if there's any women out there who's spending money on dick, you're up. doing something wrong. No, we're not spending money, bro, no. but just fucking spend- everything. That's what I'm saying. Not the old white men is spending. The- old white women spending money on, on niggas. I mean, if you old, if you older, I, I guess. But like, really? if yeah. you and your oh, white t- women, they be lonely. They be having like jaguars and stuff. They be in the house just lonely. Jaguars, like the crazy. Pet or the cars? No, no, the, the cars. Car. You know, oh, oh, okay. oh, oh crazy. Oh, oh, jaguar. They all drive jaguars. <laughs> smell like cigarettes. <laughs> Jaguars do smell like and they got like cheetah print um nightgowns. No, that's that's a crazy. That's a crazy type cat. People y'all bump into it smell like cigarettes. Yeah, you know, Jaguars. No, 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 I know, I know, I know, I know the type of cigarettes too. It's a Newport. Marlboro shorts. I thought Marlboros is black people. I mean. Nah, I smoke cigarettes. Hey, welcome Might back to the episode cigarettes? of the yes. Stereotype Show. <laughs> they talk like that. And they talk like that right now. No, no yeah, this is a cartoon character you're talking about. Well, no, 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 the cheetah print is a little, that's a little I'm, I'm lying. I don't 
don't know, nigga. I don't know they win. Hold, hold on, clear. so let me get sexy real quick. They go, they go into their room and come back out with a cheetah print like going on. No, that's a character. But cheetah they, print? They in the character. I don't think I've never seen anybody wear cheetah print. That's not a wild dog. But they were black, though. Because you didn't come across a, a, a 50-year-old like white onesie. lady who lonely. <laughs> it's that poochie gown. It's that late night. She would have fallen alive again. <laughs> hey, Shaq, man. It's fantastic to have you on the show, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, so uh, for the people who don't know... Is that from yesterday? Socks? No, these is um these are off white. Oh, those are off white socks. Yeah, yeah, off-white okay, socks. nice. I man. lost my socks yesterday. I yeah, I, I had one sock left after the um pitfall. Crazy. Hey, yeah. um, Caleb, can you show the clip of Low losing his socks? <laughs> That time when I dunked the ball, not dunk, I, I fell on the Bro. floor, and I couldn't dunk on Low because I had niggas playing defense and Low just circling like an NPC. Hey, yeah, I, that, I when I was on a fucking on a court and niggas jumping around me and I just <laughs> that shit was crazy. I was so tired. Hey, Shaq, for the people who don't know who you are, man, you want to briefly introduce yourself? Um, Shaq with two Qs. I'm just me, you know. I'm a vibe content creator trying to figure out. Uh, what to do in my life? A black man trying to find his way in the white world, you know. Um, yeah, Atlanta's technically a black. I'm gonna say we're it's yeah, black. It's pretty black. Atlanta, Atlanta. Yeah, it is, but it's still going by the white man's rules. Taxes, it's police, like that and things. Like that. Yeah, we're, we're, uh, come on, Black Boy County. We're in. We're in Us County. You can't, I don't know. you can't say where we're at right now. Uh, He'll cut it out. He'll cut it out. Hey, Caleb, cut that shit out. Come on, Black Boy. There's still a lot of black people here, though. Big no, con- yeah. It's a big contrast to a lot of other places. It's no, I love the black people. I love the black people. Oh, without a doubt, man. Yeah. yeah. I've, I've got a lot of opportunities since I've been here. And I've, tu- I've actually turned on a lot of podcasts before coming up here. Really? I've told myself that I will not accept no podcast until I get to a certain point to get on this podcast. So you're you're not originally from here? No, I'm from New York. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. New Upstate, upstate, upstate New York, Newburgh, New York is like forty-five minutes from the city. It's technically not upstate. Like if you look on the map, is the Bronx like forty-five minutes north? Now look, I'm explaining it right. City people think that New York City is the only part that exists in New York, right? So if you're not in the five boroughs, you're upstate to them. Mm. On the map, we're below the city, but since we're not in the city, we're upstate. So you're it's, south, it's ignorant, right? You're upstate. It, it don't make no sense, right? No, it really makes. We're sense. downstate, but to people who live in the city, yeah, we're upstate because you're not in New York City. Interesting. Mm, okay. Ignorance, Goodness. ignorance is bliss. It really so is. wait, so wait, wait. well, what were you doing? Were you doing content in New York? I actually like I did I did YouTube on and off. I deleted all my videos. I had like two thousand subscribers. Why? Because I got I lost motivation, so I just deleted everything. I was gonna delete my whole channel. But I don't know why I kept it, and I tried to do music. And I started working in the music industry. When I moved out here last year, February, and then you trying to rap. I rapped for a little bit, and then Are you good. I was decent. I had my first song did thirty thousand streams because I've always been popular. So even if my song wasn't good, the whole my whole city liked me, so they all supported it regardless. Mm-hmm. Can, we get so, little, can we get a little bit of it? Nah, but um, <laughs> why not? Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was a quick nah, answer, that, man. That was my um. You've been asked that a lot. But yeah, so I started doing YouTube. How again. long ago was this? Well, you say this was twenty seventeen. Oh, okay. Uh, that's a while ago. That's not that long. No, it's not. It's yeah, not it could be a classic by now, though. <laughs> yeah, it's a classic. It really depends how you it's look cl- at it. It's classically dead. But, um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I started doing YouTube in August because I went on a trip to um, Arizona. Like eight months ago? Yeah. Okay. So I started taking it serious. And, like, my whole thing Arizona? was. Went to Arizona, yeah. For, like, it was like a show. My friend does YouTube, too. And he had, like, a, a reality show he did in Arizona with, like, it was, like, eight guys and, like, 16 girls. So I got invited out there. What crazy. website was this on? It was on YouTube. It's okay. still on YouTube. Oh. Um, you should have lied to Martin. Huh? You should have lied to Martin. What do you say? I don't know what he said. <laughs> you should have lied to Martin. What the what? fuck what is that? Saying? What's the he second said, part? Nigga, that East Atlanta is just coming out crazy. Yeah, lied to Martin. You lied to what? You should. Oh. <clears throat> you should have lied to Martin. Who's Martin? Oh, okay. Sorry, I lied to you, Martin. Oh, sorry, I, lied to I just didn't want to go to Arizona. Arizona. Nah, yeah. It's not funny no more. Yeah, that, that was. <laughs> yeah, you gotta got, got explain it. So long you gotta explain the joke. It's not that funny. <laughs> but um, my problem was that like I'm friends <laughs> with a lot of big creators, and like they told me one day there was like you getting in everybody's video, and nobody has personality. So you're getting mm. in the video and making the videos lit, yeah, and making them enjoyable to watch, and they're getting money off of you, yeah, because they're just hosting the video, and then you're you're there for the whole half of the video, making girls laugh, making everybody have. Good time for sure. So do your own YouTube. Mm-hmm. So I made. I, I started again in um, Arizona. I dropped like ten videos. I got monetized in six days, and then Damn. right now I got like seven K. 
But like it's been on and off, on and off. I've been trying to just figure out how to. Uh, I've just been learning for everybody. You know, I've been around different groups and just see how people record certain things. And I don't know. I'm just trying to figure it out. But it's been good so far. I feel like uh, you know, just helping out and just being around. What were you doing between the the music until you started? You moved to Arizona or you went to Arizona? What I was doing like just hustling. So like just mm. I'm a, I'm a, I'm big on just like middle I like I like middlemen and services. So it's like I know everybody who does everything. So it's like say for instance, you might sell sneakers. Mm-hmm. And I know he might need some sneakers. Mm-hmm. And you say for a pair of Jordans you charge two fifty. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna tell him you charge three fifty. Give you your two fifty. I keep a hundred dollars and give him the shoes. We will all leave. We all leave happy. You got your money you looked for. He got the shoes him, he needed. Though. How's he not? He got his sneakers. Yeah, but you upcharge him. I'm the middleman. He would never find them sneakers if it wasn't for me. Finder's fee. So, oh, so he knows you. You upcharge. He don't him. know a damn thing. Oh, okay. he got his sneakers. He called him today. Oh, okay. Now, if one day he hits you up personally, that's tough. That's not. I'm just. I'm telling him, yo, I'm charged. It's a finder's fee. Damn. I'm not doing nothing for free Bro. no more in this world. I got bills to pay. <laughs> Tough. That is true. That is true. That is true. Yes. I know you would want to see this. What is it? He's definitely about to troll. Look at this. Just look at that real quick. Overhand it. Just look at the story. What are hmm. you doing? Old Who is this? John had just. I've been here before? His... No. Vegas. Crush. No oh, soda. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. What's Might it? even go back. You mess. You mess with my chair. You throwing women in my face. Oh, who I can't that? focus. Hmm? He's at Las Vegas. Oh, 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 interesting. Yeah, she's she's nice. That's you. You seen her? That was the first night. Where? Vegas. Vegas. I ain't always been paying attention. You know, I was in my own world, winning. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Wow. Wow. But he hit him right in his hands too. That's <laughs> tough. That's crazy. God damn. That's tough. I feel like Wes Walker, man. Yeah. Uh, so what, what type of um, content you be trying to make and stuff like that? You know? Um, lifestyle content. So it's like I like people to see my lifestyle. Like the people, my fans who watch my content should not be watching YouTube. Mm. Like the other day, I went to a gas station, and like you know in Atlanta, like the the people who I'm not gonna say the word, but the people who uh, sell merchandise to 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 black people, you know, he like, oh, I got that, I got that for you. You know what I'm saying? I walked into the gas station. You talking the water was? No, no. Oh, he was down the water. Oh, he right, right, right. saw something else. You know, some yeah, flowers. Right, right. Okay. So he's like, gas? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know if I can say gas. You know what I'm saying? Jesus. Right. But yeah, he's like, why did you scream that? I don't know why you scream that. <laughs> yeah, that was crazy. Yeah, I don't know why you <laughs> <laughs> That was, was kind of nuts. You might as well just say weed at that point, bro. You might as well say marijuana. Fuck it, bro. Yeah. You might as well just say gas. Gas is not as bad as saying marijuana. No, the cat is out the bag. You said it, though. The cat You didn't just say it. He be selling gas. You didn't say That's what the truck drivers if he was dozing off Yeah yeah uh, Keep him okay. alert So the guy He's um I walked in And he's like Cliff driver Yeah I got that um, I got a, I got a, got a guy my boy You know they say I got a guy my boy Yeah I said I'm straight I'm straight I'm paying for I'm gonna go pay for the gas He said hold on Hey twin I said like four of them Come from The other side of the store That's boy from YouTube I'm like Huh And like, hey, hey I took a picture with you I took a picture with him He said you, you, you sure you straight I get you get for the free I said yeah, maybe I might, I might need some gas. Mm, <laughs> exactly. I need a bit of gas. But yeah, like people like that, like old, like old people who don't, who shouldn't watch YouTube, be like, I, right, I see you on YouTube, drug dealers, all types of stuff. And it's like, yeah. I feel like I just like making lifestyle content. Like I don't like fabricating content. My oh, no fake content. Doing codes. The outlet. What goes in the outlet? A plug. 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 Yeah, plug. Podcast. Yeah. Yeah. It was in. Interesting. Yep. Yeah, that was, that Everything was, I need. That was good. I guess so. I guess, you know yeah. I guess so. Gas, bitches, okay. mechanics, everybody. Yeah. Yep. I guess. Nurse, <laughs> nurses. Nurses. I love I love nurses. Um CNAs. Also, that is true. I don't know if y'all that's another thing that we don't talk about. There's a lot of people who just sell gas at gas stations. Like a lot. Like yeah. in a moment. I must not from. strike them as the type because they never yeah. sell it to me. Well, where, where do you they go sell though? They sell t-shirts, bro, but they do, they do not sell They never offer you yes. They, they never, you a never lot of got, You never got offered? Never, gas never, no. Nah. They'll be rolling out not the a, window. Not a gas station, no. They be coming out of everywhere. They everywhere. I got it. I got, I, got a, I got a guy, my boy. Good guy. Also, I'm liking to 
You straight on the gap? I'm, a, I'm in a pretty suburban area too. Yeah. So. They do it over here too. Really? Yes. Yeah, they just don't. But not, but not, but not. His properties don't strike nobody. That yeah, like, yeah, you're, yeah, you're yeah. like a good guy. Like, yeah, I'm a good yeah. fucking guy, man. I tell him all the time. You could be police. Yeah. yeah. Huh? Like, huh? No, 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 I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> you could be actually. You could be actually undercover. That would actually be the reason why I would not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Twin, don't ask him twin. Yeah, I do want some. Like popping out of what though? Like my truck? Come on. Police cars, police officers. Not. First of all, they have police officers as Ford F one fifties in this. You got a big TRX. Yeah, you like you could be like a uh, undercover. I was shooting some shit over at overtime facilities the other day, and I was leaving because I was done. And there was somebody that was like, it was, she looked like Dora the Explorer. She was like looking for something in the parking lot, but there's like three cars, and I was one of them. And I was on my way out, so I thought she, I rolled my windows down to see if she was looking for me. And she's like, "Oh, I didn't think you'd be driving something like that. She didn't come back in. We missed a shot." Yeah, <laughs> so I'm talking about. That'd be a not great a, video for you to do. What if it wasn't dangerous? Go to like, go to like, uh, Cleveland Avenue. We got him. Stuff like that. <laughs> go to Cleveland <laughs> Avenue. I'm definitely getting shot. Stop, 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 stop. You want to go to Cleveland Avenue at this at this like time? JJ Fish. Stop. You, 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 you That's the one we went to, right? Uh, no, we went to the one off of University. Yeah, go deep though. Not off JJ, JJ's is very overrated. Huh? Shut the fuck up. It's very overrated. Shut up. No, no. JJ's is very. It's they have no, crack no. crack on the, the to make it more salty. Yeah, hey, I know. Yeah, I know. Yeah. The, that's the reason why black people are dying today. Cause it was kind of kind of cool, like okay, just salty fish and salty chicken. I don't no eat every day. It's so far. I only There's eat no flavor. Yeah, that's, that's not an everyday thing. Yeah. Like, I haven't had JJ fish in like two months. That's not an everyday thing. Yeah, if you JJ doing that every day? You day. crazy. Yeah, you you gonna, your heart crazy. gonna hurt. Yeah, something crazy. Your, your heart's gonna hurt. <laughs> that's only if you get yeah. extra. Let me let me get extra crack on it. What? That's what I do. Crack, yeah. crack is a spice, by the way, guys. Spice is crack. It's like it's like the white white. It's like it's salt. It's salt. There you go. Seasoning. It's not salt. It tastes like salt. It's very yeah, high. That's what makes me want to come back. Not the food. That's a fact. So it should crack. be crack. Nigga, the crack is crazy on that shit, bro. Because look, the chicken Joe, is not marinable. Yeah, we got him. It's really the catfish. I don't know why niggas fuck with their chicken. I don't really fuck with chicken like that, no cat. I fuck with their catfish. I don't bro. fuck with shit unless the crack on it. You don't that fuck is, with chicken? I don't really eat that much chicken. We've mm-hmm. had this conversation, but we why not? I just don't like chicken like that. Especially because most people don't know how to cook chicken. Unless it's fried. Not even yeah, I'm not gonna lie, can I be honest with you? Omar sucks at cooking, but in one of the camping videos, he cooked chicken one time. I think it was because it was on a grill, but it was one of them gas it wasn't a gas grill, it was like the uh, charcoal? charcoal grill. But that shit was Oh no, charcoal be hit. No, try if you hit you eat it right, charcoal. Oh, be barbecue, hit, barbecue, barbecue barbecue food yeah, always yeah, good. Omar do make some good man. watermelon too. That's so he crazy. Makes good watermelon? How do you make good watermelon? Yeah. Like he cut it, he cut it the right way? I don't know. Like he picks the right one. Right, right pieces. Yeah. Oh yeah, he does. Yeah, yeah she does. Yeah, this, there actually is a science. To so Omar is the watermelon whisperer. The one. <laughs> the fact man. that I'm trolling <laughs> and Loden has select slices of watermelon from him to agree with me is crazy. Oh no 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 no! That nigga no no no! He do he do pick the right pieces. He do pick the right pieces. Whenever I need watermelon, I call him Omar. That's only you know why. That's only because our uncle is like is a a southern old southern guy. So he's like. He like when the uncles be like, and then how you pick the water, man? Now you you, you see this right here? Yep. This, this, this nice and ripe right here. That right there, that ain't that, 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 that. That's to me, my grandma, so my right. granddad used to go. We used to go to yeah. farmer's market. Yes, that's exactly what we learned how to do yep. at the farmer's market. They sit there and they, they feel the, on the it. Where the farmer's market? I haven't seen not one since I moved here. It's one. Go, up the street. <laughs> really? Yeah. Bro, I never see them. No, nobody about that. They don't, they they don't block off roads? Shit. They block off roads for thing. They well, block off. the one here isn't that big. Go to the one in Jonesboro where they have like a whole yeah. their whole exit, and it's like you can just okay. I like that's that. Crazy. Yeah, they got you, mangoes. Like, you can like literally from Mexico. Drive. It's way more than that. You can drive <laughs> through the lanes. Oh, that's what I mean. Mexico. Mexico. Yeah, the mangoes from Mexico slap. Ooh, we should do a video. Trying to, to trade fried chicken market? for watermelon. If they don't accept it, they're racist. That's trying okay. to trade just, fried chicken for watermelon. Whatever he wants to see <laughs> in this episode, bro. Mom. I'm still thinking we want a Patreon video. <laughs> We're not. <laughs> We're not. We're not, dog. <laughs> Caleb going to have a hard time editing this shit. Look, um, yeah, I don't like fr- I don't like chicken that much at all. Like yeah, I get that. Um, I love chicken. Crazy. I don't know. Like, what do you eat then if you don't like chicken? Everything I else. Yeah, beef. Pause, 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 pause. That's and not pause. What the hell? No, nah, beef is crazy. No, that's, that's, crazy. That's, that's an animal. animal. That's beef crazy. is insane. That's, that's all you eat? That's how you except, got to where you out? Like, no, that was, you know what I was about to say? I said beef except for nuts. And I was like, <laughs> <laughs> So you have a high beef I'm allergic, intake. I'm allergic, I am allergic to nuts. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I think, I think all big black men are allergic to nuts. You chew, you chew beef, you just swallow it. What? You cut up and swallow pieces? Of what? 
I feel like sometimes if you're like really hungry, I feel like if we did an experiment and like starved you for like three days, that you probably wouldn't swallow food. You skip chewing and just swallow. No, nah, that's nuts. No, I ain't gonna lie. Swallow some food whole is next level. Like hungry, hungry. Yeah, your you stomach. Not, but, I'm gonna be honest. This may be the fattest shit I ever said, <laughs> bro. I love keeping food in my mouth, bro. This it's it's savory in my mouth, bro. I he get said the, it. Asian. I he did. Get the he said it. Nigga. He said it. Process it. He nigga, said it. Uh, why? Who would ever swallow food whole, nigga? Like you get to taste the food when it's in your mouth. Why you, you never ate it? it when, how many days it took we do without eating? I haven't eaten today. Like I right now, I'm not eating a single. So thing. now think about adding two more days. You're not thinking about shit. You're not thinking about savor. Hey, man. I ain't even been a day. But hey, hey, back to you, Shaq. Um, Actually, that's like the. What, 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 what type of lifestyle content are you talking about? Um, Really, women. Like, oh, wow. I'm a. But my, my approach is different, though. Oh, so, right. like, you know, most, like, content creators on YouTube, when they have women in their content, mm-hmm. it's like, I'm going to show you guys that I could get the most women in the world. Yeah. So, you guys think I have a lot of women. Mm-hmm. And in my content, it's like, the women are. Uh, like a background So it's like I'm gonna do Whatever I'm doing But like I barely pay attention That they there mm-hmm. And like They be trying to talk to me Like I'll talk to them I'll make them laugh Make them have a good time And I show people That you don't really have to Like try to do things With all the girls around you Okay mm-hmm. you, can, so, you could just You know what I'm saying You could just be kicking And you could be vibing Like man. I could be in, I, could, I could be in a vlog With women They could be drinking Going on Whatever it might be Doing you know what I'm saying And not make no advances And I'm just be chilling Right. And they be like, oh my, and the women be hitting me up, like on my DMs, they be like, I love how in your content, you don't over-sexualize women. I'm like, yo, I, when I grew up, I had, I had a lot of partners. So at this point now, I'm 25, I'm like, what's a lot? A number? Yeah, what's a lot of partners? Is that a number? <laughs> I never, I don't really, like, I have an estimate in my head, but what's when the, I say it, it doesn't, it doesn't sound logical when but I what's say the, it. Well, what is it though? Uh, I can't say. They just give a range. Come on, social blade it. How old are you? I'm 28. Damn. Damn. <laughs> For real? Fuck. <laughs> you know what's so crazy? I still low ball. I'm 29. Damn. Oh, oh, how old are you? I'm 26. Ancient. Ancient. <laughs> I heard you first time, nigga. Oh. <laughs> I heard you. So it's, 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 it's higher than both your ages put together. Damn. And he's old, so. There's a lot of niggas out here that be claiming like, oh, I don't want to be a big nigga. Big niggas getting more pussy yeah. than these little niggas. Okay. But I've been getting a lot because I've been funny my whole life. What the fuck? I've been, I've been funny my whole life, so it's been working out. I lost my virginity at 13. Wow. In so London. somebody in your London. age? In London. This is my your age? No, she's like 14. Oh, I mean, that's the Nobody ever believes the story. Like, I, I went to London for Christmas, mm-hmm. and my grandma, and like, where we stayed at, their neighbor across the street invited us over for dinner. Mm-hmm. And we played San Andreas. Type shit. On a big screen TV with the fat back. I remember it so vividly. Mm. And then I was playing with her with the brother. And then I went to go play house with the sister. She had a pink room. You was playing house. Playing house. It was with like Barbies me. and shit? Nah, well, well, our bodies. She was a mom, I was a dad. And then mm. the, the brother was a son. So she sent the brother, she sent the brother to his room. You was role playing at 13? Yeah. Wow. You never done that before? You never know, played house before? No. I mean, it's probably, it's probably American. Toys. I, I play, I play Wait, house. Yeah. So he, he invited you over to his house. To no, no, no. The, the, the mom invited me over. So the, I just met him. He allowed y'all to play random, house, like another nigga to come over his house and role play their kids. It, they, they, the, 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 the brother was younger though; he's like nine. No, You're but it's, like, it's it's home court advantage. Your first like, sexual my house, I'm always home. Play? Yeah, in London. Wow, <laughs> ain't gonna be the son at my house. How did you get? How did you go from like <laughs> the house you were in? Like what? How, what did the role play look like? How do you even bridge it? To it was. Set? I ain't gonna lie. I think she did it before plenty of times. Like. Why? Because <laughs> I think I think she's experienced because she walked me through it like so she was yo, yo, her walking you through out of being a father in role play is crazy. No, nah, it was like it was like we lay on the bed. Like we lay on the bed. It's like she sent she sent her little brother to the room or whatever, and it was literally like twenty minutes, twenty minutes was in the room, and like I didn't know what to do, so I was just laying there. Like she took my pants off. She that's put it, not house. But what the hell? Oh, that, that's what I, that was house for her. Yes. House for me was just laying there. But there was a lead up to that that part, right? I promise you, the lead up was probably two seconds of talking. What? And then it was oh, all no, that's the house. That's not house. No, 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 that's not house. I mean, I don't remember that vividly. What? Like, what? <laughs> <laughs> so you said she just put it in? Nigga, <laughs> shut up! Shut the fuck! <laughs> so your first, your first Nigga, time having sex was what sex? Huh? At fourteen? Why are we? What? what? <laughs> you said, a, you said, no butt sex. I think, I think, I think, I think. What is? <laughs> 
Hey, what you, I think 13, 13 year old stories with John should be talked about. Hey, nigga, John, we suck the fuck up, John. You said he was laying there, she pulled it out and put it in. Yeah. John, she didn't lick it Shit. I mean, I, I don't remember. I just remember just doing it for like five, 10 minutes, and I felt the, and I felt the, I felt the, I felt like a little a, a coldness on my back, and I felt that felt like, I thought I was peeing. So where you put the extra kids at? I don't know. I, I gotta, yo, this, this podcast. Did she dispose of them or? I don't know. I remember. I remember the, the little brother walked in. Wait, pause. <laughs> like mid pump, like she she told him to leave again. It was hilarious. Like she did. I'm, I'm pretty the sure guy she was playing San Andreas with walked in the room. Yeah, he's like, "Come on, let's keep playing." And then she's like, "Get out!" I'm like, "All right, all right, good times." Okay, yeah. hold on. Let me get this straight. You. Went from playing San Andreas, went up to a room, and in mm-hmm. under two seconds, we're on a bed. Hunching. And you guys played house. Yeah, it's like... That's not minutes. house. Like, did you have a front or something? But, I mean, but think about it, though. It's not a house, but in most households, that's what, that's what happens. But did you have a front They get right to it. Straight to it like a dancer. You know what else also happens in most households? Watching television. I, I watch it already with the, with the sons. Cutting grass. That's overrated, man. Now, think about it, though. Think overrated. about it, though. If... We have to make it... Norm, we have to normalize. Just get, get into it. Come yeah. On. Pull it out. Look, he was, he was go. the, the, the little brother was a son. So technically, I did my duties by playing the game with him for a little while. Then went to the room with the mom and got funky. <laughs> I saw a post. It's Yo. like normalized women just pulling down the drawers. And, and nah, doing it. but see the thing is, like, I don't, I don't totally, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't agree with that. Get surprised like that, okay, long. wait, I don't agree with that. So like, there's guys, too much shit being just random miscellaneous. Okay, so it's, you don't lay down it. That was your first time. No, yeah. okay, I need that. So, but 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 after like, what do you like? From, how do you? From, from, we know this from ten to thirteen. I watched a uh, uh, unhealthy amount of porn. Okay. Like I had a porn addiction when I was a kid. What, what was your favorite category? This is getting worse. Oh, you super. What's your favorite category? Homemade. Wow, okay. Yeah, homemade is homemade yeah, because yeah, yeah, homemade I, I like homemade because even like now, if I watch porn right now, it's going to be homemade. Yeah. Because I feel like it could be me. <laughs> like, it's more, it's more homemade is crazy. <laughs> no, I'll take I don't know why you would like you watch like eb- ebony, no. ebony little people orgies. No, nah, that's crazy. What? <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> this is crazy. That's crazy. Okay. okay. I like, so I like homemade because it's not 4K. Like, it's like phone footage. So, so you basically you re- reenacting yeah. the shit you didn't see in the videos. Nah. I, once, once, once it was in, I was in porn mode. Okay. So I wasn't doing nothing. I was just hunching. But like I knew that I had to just keep it in and just keep going. Yeah. That's all. I, that's all. That's my only goal. That's okay. My, that's so when you got done, like, what did you guys talk about? Uh, nothing. I'm about to play the game. Yo, she used you. Yeah. Like, she yeah. brought you story, up there. Story of my life. Fucked you and then. Damn. Took and you, you back down. And it's still happening now to this day. Just being used by women. Wow. There's a lot of things that y'all said in the, in the last did, 10 minutes. How did, that the parent, how did y'all parents not find out? My mom found out because I told I did a story to him on YouTube and she watched my video on YouTube. <laughs> and then she, but you know, it is like, I'm telling you, a lot of people never believe the story. They're like, there's no way. My mom knew it was real because I went to London four times. Mm-hmm. So it, the timeline matched up. So she's like, really, O'Neill? My real name's O'Neill. Really, O'Neill, you never told me this, blah, blah, blah. blah. I'm like, one plus one plus what would I tell you at 13 that I just got done hunching? Yeah, that's a fact. Yeah, yeah right, you know what I'm saying? And at this point, now <laughs> now she knows I'm nasty, so now she's like... Wow. Oh, she know you nasty. You guys are so open. <laughs> yeah, she nah, because she, cause she has me on Instagram, and she has me on um, mm-hmm. YouTube. So what's like, so what's like, that game called when you play where, where you, y'all, it's like hide and go seek, but you turn the lights off for the... Hide game. and go get it. Hide and go get it, yeah. I've, I've played that game. Yeah, now. I played hide all, those, all those freaky games. What, what, all the freaky what games. is hide and go get it? Break that one down. You hide and go get it. Get what? Get what? Whatever you can get. That's a game. So I like. Yeah. So, like, so all, yeah, the, bro, all the girls I really hide when I was younger, though. All the girls hide, and then like the guys, like you gotta go get it. Are they go trying get to get what? away? Hmm? Go get what? Whatever they give you. Okay, so we're all this, in the dark. In this in this mm-hmm. game, she's trying to get away. No, they just hide. It's like, so it's like, like hide and seek. Oh, like hide, okay, like hide and seek. Okay. But when you go seek them, you, you like Marco Polo. Nah, but no, no, go no. Seek, it's, like, it's like hide and go seek with seven minutes of heaven. So when you find them, you just stay in the hiding spot and do it. We well, find the wrong yeah. one. No, you're not gonna find the wrong one. No, nah, but but every every time I play, I play with me, me, Oh, not you! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> oh, I didn't see you there. <laughs> yeah, just keep going. I'm next. Be, wait, 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 when, I, I, when, I, when I remember it though, when I remember it though, it was it was um, 
you just the the ones the You're one not. you wanted to like seek yeah. out. <laughs> they they y'all kind of knew where to. Yeah, we, we, y'all, y'all knew like, where to like, go. Like you knew where they're going. You knew where to go. Like, like, knew, oh, like, you play that with a group? Yeah, a group. So it'd be like it'd be like ten guys, ten girls, but it'd be like kind of part. It'd be kind of part. I ain't play with that many. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. oh no, I'm for, I was in the hood. But yeah, but you yeah you play well. So what happens when you find something you don't want to do no what? You put it back, but you, you close know, your eyes like you ain't seen nothing. Yeah, you, just, you, you don't say nothing, you just keep going. You but, go you, on. you go, oh. but you know, <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, that's, touch. Touch. Oh, that's probably just the wall. <laughs> <laughs> this is just the wall. Uh, but you know, but you know where to kind of go though. Like yeah. they they had the same hiding spots and they do that purposely so y'all both oh, can. So yeah, they'll like, tell okay. you they're like. I'm hiding under the so seat. So what does everyone else do while y'all uh, are doing, doing the same thing? They're doing too. the same thing. The rest of the guys are looking for their partners. Oh, all and guys are going to go get time? Yeah. yeah. It probably stank in there, didn't it? <laughs> no, it'd be like outside, it'd be inside. It just yeah, it's not always, yeah. Interesting. Mm-hmm. But the house thing, no, I've never. Never no, play no. house? So I, was, I played it, but not to games. that extent. It's like the other games. Yeah, I never, I never. Games. After that time, I never played house again at that like level. After that, I was just <laughs> that level was crazy. After, after I was that, never able to get past level one at that point. <laughs> Thirteen is what grade is that? That's like thirteen is like eighth seventh grade, grade. No. seventh grade, seventh grade. Yeah. yeah. After that, That's I started. Eight. I went back, went back home. And I started bugging this school. Like now, I know what to do. Like in, in my middle school, girls were doing that already. Like wow, giving head and stuff like that. And I just didn't. I never knew how to approach it, so I never tried. After that, though, I went on a rampage. But you didn't learn anything, though. She no, nah, but you know, but you know, once you do something for the first time, now your confidence is through the roof. Oh, okay. Now yeah. I know. Now I know what to do. So now I was like, I came back home to all the guys. Yeah, I got, I got me some. Mm. Some of the guys never got some. Yeah. So now I had one up. Mm. Uh-huh. So now when the word spread, the girls the want to get some. Spread. Yeah, you know, it's a small school. You know, when the, when the girls find out that you got some, they're like, he experienced. So I've never did nothing. So I want to try it now. Interesting. Mm. So it had fun. So you was just taking virginities. Mm. Nah, not that much. Mm. Like a couple. <laughs> they call you Shaq the Cherry Popper. Nah, nah. <laughs> you a Shaq. Nah, 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 Have nah, you nah, what? Nah, 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 nah. I heard you went to the Cherry Popper's house. How was it? <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, what are we talking about, bro? Yeah, talking talk about, talk about, talk about cherry popping is kind of insane. That's, that's crazy, bro. Kind of crazy. <laughs> we let's on, let's, let's fast forward to 2029. Yeah, 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 yeah. But now that we're back from all that, man. Just some good couches. Um, you do content with women and shit. Yeah. Um, how many crushes have you posted on YouTube? Crushes? Yeah. Um, <laughs> it's none. Okay. I, never, I never labeled the girls like a crush on my channel. Okay, okay. Or like best friends. I don't do stuff like that. Like okay, I put okay. up their name. Okay, okay, mm. okay. Like people, I don't know why guys back like they scared to say the girls and like we want to steal a girl or something. I'm telling you, if I want her, I'm gonna get her. Yeah, like, yeah. you can hide. I don't man. care how much you hide. I'm you going to the comments all day. What's her name? What's her name? You can like, blow her, her name. Out. Yeah. I'm still gonna find her. You're gonna find her. Yeah. Cause yeah. on top of that, if she if she fucking with somebody anyway, then at that point, like you already know she ain't really yeah. fucking. with they be lying like, oh, I put crush for the algorithm. Shut up. You trying to hide her. Hey, this portion of the podcast right here, man, is sponsored by Honey. Look, man, we all love to shop online, but did you know you could be saving money for free without having to do anything? Mm. Yep, that's when Honey comes in, man. Check it out. So you download the Honey extension, right? The Honey extension is going to scour the internet for coupon codes, and upon your checkout, if a coupon code exists, it'll find it, man, and then boom, you saved yourself some bread. You feel me? Back in the day, you had to, like, search online for promo codes and then, like, keep trying them until you figured out what worked. It was like a 10, 15-minute process. Now, it searches them all automatically. Within seconds, you find out if there are savings, you're making them. Just recently, I was buying some bed sheets, some pillow sheets, and, and stuff like I have to move. You know, we got packed up from the A&P house and saved $40. So, mm-hmm. and I didn't have to do anything. The money put right back in my pocket. Mm-hmm. And what I do with it? Invested it in real estate. On top of that, man, Honey just doesn't work on desktop. It works on your iPhone too. Just activate it on Safari on your phone and save it on the go. Hey, look, man, if you don't already have Honey, you could be straight up missing out. And by getting it, you'll be doing yourself a solid and helping support the show. I'd never recommend something I don't use, and that's facts. Get Honey for for free or join honey.com slash peer that's honey.com slash peer it's a huge thank you to honey for sponsoring this portion of the podcast that's yeah. crazy yeah, if the algorithm is going to pick it up it's going to pick it up mm. yeah, fast, fast, don't, don't try to say yeah, okay, what are they key words in these crush I got videos. some detectives in my mind I was watching a cheating video and I told one of my mods I was like that girl bad I said I'll change her life they said her information it. in five minutes mm-hmm. you'll change her life what do you mean by that break that uh, down you'll change your life yeah like she didn't have some bad things happen I'm gonna give her some slightly good things. Slightly good. I'm the opposite. I'm gonna I'm fuck a girl life up. What the fuck are but y'all a, saying? But like, like a good way. In a good way. In a good, good way. way. Good so way. Like, I'm gonna show you like I'm gonna show you enough to make you fall in love and then act like I nothing happened afterwards. Wow. 
That's not a good way. No, that's yeah. a horrible way. But but that's not good. In their mind, they're gonna be so much in love that they're not gonna realize, oh, that is fucked up. Huh? Why would they not be? Why would because you take advantage of that? It's not taking advantage. You gotta yes, play. It it's chess, not checkers, brother. Why are you so playing what? chess? Why are you playing chess? Why are you playing chess? Listen. This nigga think he future. Group <laughs> 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 upcoming. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's not. You gotta That's think. a bad joke, Joe. So, you know, know, I got was, it, but God. Nah, you can't tell me that. I can't. You can't, you can't tell me that was a bad joke. Anybody else can tell me. I can. Damn. You can't tell me that. That's tough. I'm, kinda, I'm, I'm, still, I'm still on John's team. We did beat you guys. But, um, oh, wow. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Tell me my joke is bad. I know it, miss. <laughs> <laughs> they don't all hit. No, nah, but yeah, it's chest not tricky. But wait, why, why? Okay, why, why are you. So you meet a woman who, who's had a bad pass. Okay. And then you date her, and then you show her like a little. I don't date girls though. Okay, I'm very, I'm very, I communicate. You just talk. So I just talk to them, and like I'm gonna show that they can lean on. But then like things always happen and with girls. Dick that you can suck on. Yeah, I'm that. I'm that guy that 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 like the memes talk about. Like, don't let your girl go cry on another guy's shoulder. Yeah. Because you're gonna hit that motherfucker. I'm gonna hit that motherfucker. Mm-hmm. So what's that process look like? Do you? How long do they cry before? before nah, you put your I'm, not, I'm not different. Yeah. No crying. I don't want to see crying. I feel like we see crying. You shouldn't be fucking that person. That's kind of crazy. Okay. Like now you they take they take that is complaining. Crazy. That is crazy. Yeah, like you let them complain. I feel like I have like a healing spirit. Okay. So like mm. people people come to me to laugh and to all smile. the the healing properties are in the tip. Yeah. Yeah. So they gotta suck. That dick of yours <laughs> to get healed. Nah, you know what it is though. I feel like it's this is like when you do so much for a woman, where like you listen to them for so long, you communicate, you help them get through a, yeah. a situation, whatever it is. For most women, that's how they show their appreciation because they know that's uh, guys. We want some sex. Okay. I don't care what that, part of the earth. Isn't that a lot of effort try, though? That's a lot of effort. You gotta, I, I, I'm that guy who's gonna show a lot of effort. You're gonna and help them win overcome because, life trauma. Yes. Get your dick sucked. No, it's not just that. It's like once you get a girl through certain things, she will love you forever. Oh, so it's always chess because you got to think at the end of the day, like certain guys will text a girl like, "What you doing? Da da da. da. What you doing? What you doing?" Me, I'll call a girl randomly. How's your day going today? Talk to me. What's the problem? You all right? That's crazy. You got because you got somebody got to do it. So why not be me? You know, you know, and you and I heard. No, Shaq, my nigga, what my nigga cheated on me again. You said boyfriends. What's crazy is ninety percent. I promise you, ninety percent of my <laughs> bodies huh? were girls who had boyfriends. A GTA. Ninety percent of your, the body that he had had boyfriends. Yeah, and this is why I'm scared to get a girlfriend. Just because, like, I know, I say like, same thing. I know what. What this, you? What you? Say I'm the, the smoothest thing? man in the world. Not ninety percent. No, not ninety percent. I'll say about seventy five. I try to steer away from it. The most time I know the nigga. Yeah. Nah, I never know the nigga. And if I know them, it's like they be fans. What? Not fans, like literally, but they be like the guys who be like, yo, Shaq, what's yeah, up, because, bro? Like, they'll post their niggas and shit. So I don't know she'll have one, but I'm not going to bring it up because yeah. it's not my place. It's not, listen, it's not destroying a happy home. It is. It's yeah. not. No, the, home, the, home, really is. the home is not happy if she's outside. Yeah, if she's sucking my dick, it's not if you, happy. If you got a good foundation, you can't. Like if your house is built so, on good so, foundation, you can't just blow. So, that's y'all, a mad home. Y'all, y'all are saying down. that you are doing him a favor. favor. Yes, I'm doing the Lord's work. I don't know if it's the Lord's, Lord's work, work though. Not the Lord's work. <laughs> I don't know if it's the, the, I don't know I don't if it's the Lord's work. The Lord said, "Be fruitful and what? Multiply." He didn't tell. Uh, but you're not multiplying though. You're not. Yeah, you're I mean, she, out, I'm multiplying because she's having multiple niggas. But it's not oh, even okay. sweet fruit. You know what I'm saying she's being fruitful. She's multiplying. Okay. Like, I feel well, like man. you misunderstood that bar. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, <laughs> he definitely was not saying that. But look, that's how that's how that's how slavery started. That is how slavery started. Yeah, taking scriptures and just <laughs> twisting and turning them to make people believe what you're talking about. Very yeah. much so, unfortunately. Look, man, uh, I'm I'm gonna say right now, uh, something around both of y'all. Let me be clear, because um, I don't know how y'all came to these conclusions about women. What? Yeah, I you, if, if, if you, I'm not saying y'all don't. Yeah, I'm yeah. not saying I'm not saying y'all don't. I'm not saying y'all don't. But like shut shut and all. When I be, t- I just be talking. Just I don't talking. Even do much. Yeah, just they talk. just go. And just you gotta ask him like I have a, like women love me. All the girls around me are in love with me because oh, no. like I showed them like I showed them the the kind of man they're looking for. Oh, what is that? Okay, well, let me ask. Yeah, what uh, is that? Like, what is that? Like, mean? A, like a sincere, emotional, uh-huh. emotionally intelligent. Like I, I was. My dad died when I was six. Uh-huh. It, got, it got deep really fast. My dad died when I was six. Yeah. So I was raised. I'm the only child, only grandchild, only nephew. Oh wow. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? So I was very lonely. Yeah. So I grew up with only women. My mom, when I was like 10, no, like probably like 15, probably a little bit older. My mom went to the hospital for heartbreak syndrome. Heartbreak, heartbreak? syndrome, yeah. That's like, that's like when you you so like, like say for like, you get so heartbroken that it almost causes a heart attack. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's how, that's how strong your heart really is. 
So like I've learned like I learned on an early age emotional intelligence and like tolerance and certain certain things. So like I can on it. So it's like I can't help it but to <laughs> why are you looking at me? No, 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 I'm, I'm yawning. I didn't want to, like, open my mouth and yawn. He has a big cause, jaw. Because these niggas, <laughs> yeah. if yeah. I start, if I open my mouth and yawn, you, I know you niggas probably would have had like, a dread in his mouth. Nigga, your mouth dreads. open. <laughs> no, so I wasn't, I was just. No, nah, but yeah, so, like, I'm just emotionally intelligent, and a lot of guys aren't. A lot of guys don't know how to, like, you know, keen on emotions and realize when somebody's going through something. Like, I know when people are going through something. That sounds like a lot of work. It does sound like a lot of It's effort. not when you're used to it. If, just, you, if, you, if, you, if you're not used to it, it's like, I'm not doing all that. Like I'm not I'm not texting a girl every day. I'm not calling a girl. You're texting her every day. Every day, multiple. No, nah, that's just a lot, nigga. Though. Every day. I can only do that for so long, and then I'll just unless I'm seeing you, I get bored. I get bored fast. No, I get bored too. So I start calling. Like I call a random, just like have a quick. But if I'm not seeing that person, hang up. I don't like it. Like, like say if we're texting but not linking or something, it's a waste yeah. of time for me. Why am I talking to you every day? See, and then person like that's going to give up, and guess what? Yeah, it could have been three of us in a race, and he gave up. Another guy gave up, and guess who's still there? Me. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna give but how, up. But how long is this? How long is this long? I'm definitely gonna give my up. My ex, my ex. I was talking to my ex for a year before we even did anything. Well, I thought you don't date these women. I don't. I only have three girlfriends in my life. Okay. So and then my ex cheated on me. So I'm, it's not. I'm, I'm not gonna. Damn. Uh, what she do? I, I kind of want to tell the story because me and my ex kind of cool now, and I doubt she probably will see this. But the story's kind of crazy. Like I could write a novel about. Like, you can put it on. We can put it on um, Patreon if you think she. Was All right. Here. So look, my ex. Mm. Right. This, this is gonna get really deep, really fast. My ex cheated on me, but it's, it was kind of my fault because I fell in love too fast. Like, I'm a lover. Like if I love you, I really, no, really love not. you. There's nothing about you what you just said in the past <laughs> five, five minutes. That's sad. By me, I, I, I feel like no. that, that right there made him what he was. Yeah, so look, I'm made him so heartless. heartless. A big when, heartless. When, when, when was, no, I'm, was not, I'm not heartless. No, it, was like, it was like a two No, you heartless? Ago. You don't give a fuck about these hoes. But no, I'm right. not heartless. I love women. I just what know, the- I just know, like you love their abilities, right? Nah, <laughs> Nigga, it's hard to put in words. Like I love women. It's like I'm not heartless. Like if I, I could get a girlfriend right now, if I wanted to, like I'm talking to somebody seriously. But right you're not. You're just gonna fuck them and, and fuck over their emotions. Nah, not fuck with their emotions. I'm gonna teach them about themselves. So mm, teach them about themselves. Yeah, <laughs> mm. it's your eye. that's just as bad as what that nigga just said. No cap. But listen, back to the story. So my ex, she cheated on me, and I found out because I had um, for Christmas I had. Spent like a thousand dollars. Went to Roof Chris. Mm. I, got, I, got a, I, got a, uh, I got a hotel room. Put mm. the, you know, put the rose petals on the floor. Shit. That's all the stuff, failure. you know. Damn! Nah, he got a big job. Oh, <laughs> yo, yeah. yo, you you are like a whale. <laughs> Where's my wallet? Like, like you know, like, you know, a whale opening him up. That's why I, I yawn like this. That's why I yawn like this. <laughs> He's like Kirby. <laughs> Okay. That boy gonna suck in it. He gonna have a Shaq outfit on. He about to suck the Shaq fit off. He gonna have all black it's on. Toxic. His attributes of dreads. <laughs> <laughs> no, Kirby oh, sucked you up to get his powers. Oh, all right. But yeah, so she, um, we did all that. We did our thing. I used Honey that night. And um, shout out to Honey. Um, <laughs> did you really? Yeah, Royal Honey. Used it that night. Oh. If you know, you know. Yeah, um, yeah. And then like a week later, a week later, she posted like, she posted and deleted Mad Fast. It was like a picture of her in the, in the mall, in like a a, a dressing room mirror mm. with another nigga. Mm. The I same s- night? No, nah, like a week later. Oh, damn. it was probably like the first week of January, and I seen that. So I was I was devastated. And then, what did that mean to- though? She she run with another she nigga. with another nigga. You know what I'm Wait, saying? So when you like this, for example, for all the little niggas out there, when you spit this, when you spit this band on her, it's like you did that because you care. Yeah, I ain't spending because I ain't, I ain't spending to be like <laughs> I wanted the money back. That sounds like a tutor trying to yeah. teach kids. Yeah, yeah. 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 no, like you spend a th- <laughs> like this is shit right here. Bro. If I spent a thousand on a girl, and she did that shit. <laughs> Yeah. I'm going to terrorize nah, the I, main no, five he's bitches. Not. He's not in GTA. That was a joke. You're being you're being hyperbolic. Hyperbolic? Right. Yeah, I'm going to hyperball my and all her friends. <laughs> <laughs> my fist though. Nah, but I, what? I don't, <laughs> nah, but I'm not I, I don't I ain't really care. Like it was like I was more so mad at myself for just getting yeah. so deep with the person and she did that. So like I ain't really I ain't retaliate. Really fuck the emotion. Well, you don't even know if they fucked. I'm thinking about nah, the No, they started dating afterwards. So yeah, fuck my emotions. Mm, so we ended up. I, we had like a little back and forth on social media, and we broke up, or whatever it might be. And then she started dating the guy, 
And like um, She moved to Atlanta Probably shortly after And mm-hmm. I moved out here last year And he got He got um, This is for the Patreon right here Oh shit 13 I went to my crazy. first Fucking Louis yeah, store uh, Goddamn A few <laughs> weeks ago For a video Man, what an odd fucking planet that place is. It is. Louis? Did they yeah. give you stuff? Like, can you spend money? Did they give you, like, drinks? Champagne? Mm, like, that's not water. those. Though. I know, nah, it's, man, I I know what that. you're talking about. It's not those. But uh, there, are, there are places where, like, if you spend enough money in this place, or yeah. even if you look like it, they'll it's start been like, paying it's out. It's been, like, $4,000. Yeah, I, I saw them bring, bring out food one time. Yeah, they'll do that. They had dress yeah. so long, they had food and shit. Yep. Yeah, yeah, like, 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 crackers and cheese. Yeah, bro, it's so weird. Like, they were just opening up walls. And it would open up into a new room. And I'm like, how, how do I get in there? Y'all went to Phipps? Uh, yeah. 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 And, and that's, I went, that's where the real rich people go. And I went into like, Linux is still not a real rich people go to one guy's apartment. This guy has an apartment. Well, that too, yeah. Man. Oh, I, was, I need to go there. Bro, this guy had an apartment with millions of dollars of goods in there, man. All designer, Shit. everything. Where you Some Asian at? guy sitting behind a desk. I never I'm seen nothing like it. <laughs> <it. laughs> right up in that apartment real quick. Yeah, man. That shit was nuts. You should do that, though. What? I'm trying to spoil someone's daughter. A trick See, idea. I'm trying to spoil ideas. someone's daughter. That's actually a brilliant idea. I'm yeah, not going to lie. That's a brilliant idea. Yeah, Come that's, that's a good because idea. Because I'm assuming like if you... Especially like, I don't want to though, bro. Unless the sponsor's no, 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 going to yeah, help yeah, me yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, no, no. I'm not paying out my pocket for... <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> you can write it off. You can use me. He can yeah, write that's it off. That's all right. That's You can use me as a nigga that's tricking off and you get the video and I get the fun. What? What are you saying? So instead of him standing out there, I'll hold the sign. I'll use your money. You'll make the video. I'll trick on the girl. I'll have my fun. You get your banger. It's still his money, what? though. What? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Hey, yo, I'm going to carry it to your video. What, so I got it. So the yeah. purpose of the video is going to be to discover if it's fun to trick. Yeah. Okay. Yo, I'll let you know. I'll give you a detailed review. <laughs> no. You can interview me like in the side. <laughs> but this, this, this is what I mean. Like, if you single nah, that's and you want That's what Mr. Beast does, though, by yeah, the way. No, no, exactly, no. yeah. But we, we, we call it donating he be, when he does it. Mr. Beast <laughs> tricking all day. Mr. Beast does. <laughs> Mr. Beast does trick, actually. That's what nigga does, actually. Hey, Mr. Beast built a well in, I think it was Senegal. It was in Africa. And this shit made me so happy, bro, because there's a whole bunch, just thousands of people never seen fucking clean water right there by their house, mm-hmm. man. They were celebrating like it was like a spiritual thing happening. Yeah, but no. like, what the point I'm making is if you single and you want to go to LA, right? But you want to like you don't know nobody to go with. Like, mm-hmm. You just tell a girl like, "Hey, come with me to LA." I would. Okay, yeah. But you would pay for her to come to LA, though. Of course. Like, if it's if it's my girlfriend. No, 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 no. Not your girlfriend. Oh, if it's a str- like a, just a person I'm talking to. So uh, talking to or just a I someone on IG. Oh, no, no, no. Let like, you be to fun to be shit. with. I don't know her. Not book a flight. No. See? No, no, no! I'm not no. tricking. No, that's just, that's I'm just no, no, no that is tricking. You might classify as tricking me. I just classify it like that's. I'm just, I'm just gonna do it. Like, I don't, I don't think of it like like certain things. Like I won't think of it before I do it. But like you should what? though. You should. Nah, you should. But, but it's, it's a like, flight. It's a flight, but it's like no, you booking everything. Nah, but to LA is kind of. I have never been to LA, so I don't know what them flights. But let's look say, like. let's say, let's say you want to go to Aspen, but you want to go alone. I'm right? fine. I'm fine with me because I I, I yeah, want you to do it. Aspen flight is a thousand. The stay is to Aspen what Colorado? Yeah, <laughs> thousand dollars. Aspen's the most expensive city in the country. For real? Like Aspen, oh, Africa? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Nah. So, gonna, but nah, like, we, how expensive does it have to get before you're like, all right, you about to pay? It's pitch tricking in. regardless. Nah, I, get nah, that. Yeah, I understand. It, 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 it may be is. tricking, but like for a person like me, I won't like, like I ain't gonna think like, damn, should I do this? Cause I'm tricking. I'm let's, like, let's say you spend five thousand on a trip total. I ain't I ain't there yet. Okay. But would you it. ask her to chip in? If let's, I'm, let's say it, you have a hundred thousand. No, but you if I got a hundred thousand. I'm gonna pay for it because if I got a hundred thousand, I'm making that money. Five percent of your net worth. But I'm, but I'm gonna make it back some way somehow. How? If I have a hundred thousand, I'm making money somehow. Yeah, but I don't what have a hundred thousand. My luck. She probably going. It, <laughs> like, I'm probably. I'm going to trip. Scenery is a crazy because you gotta think about it. When girls suck a dick a certain way, it. It reaches <laughs> creativity. I think my creativity nerve is in my dick. No, I feel you. Because she said it the right way, no, I get a wrong. blast of ideas. No, so you, th- you, yeah. think, you think that's an investment to your it's creativity? Oh, that's what you're trying to say. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't even bridge that gap, huh? brother. <laughs> Sometimes you got creativity in your brain, in your head. You know what they call it's that? In my head. You know what they call that? They call what? it a muse. What? A muse. A muted? A muse. A muse. Like there's women who say. <laughs> 
There, no, no, I mean, so serious. I'm so serious. There's there's women who say that they, they they were Drake's muse. Like when Drake was in the studio writing, he has women around him to motivate yeah. him. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what that's what they, they said. Oh yeah, yeah. Probably. I mean, I mean, I'm pretty pretty he did it around. That's a role. But they, yeah. oh, but they, they just, but they, just they do. Around, they get naked. But that's See? wait, wait, wait. wait. I'm telling you, it's a real thing. thing. That's the lie that they sell. Like I'm just, I was just in the studio with him. Like that's the lie. Yeah, and they but we know like what they were also doing. Yeah, I think I think this is why I'm like a big YouTuber. Dick sucked in the studio is crazy. Why we just overlooking that? Someone's studio, unless it's at your crib, getting your dick sucked at a studio. How do you think he, how you think he, how you think he pulls out all that pain? Huh? Oh. What you mean pull out all this pain? You all right, brother? Like, like, how you think he gets there without his dick getting sucked? All right, John. What the fuck, man? Maybe he you just think Drake just records music with an unsucked dick. <laughs> you think he's in there recording hits with a dick that hasn't been sucked yet? <laughs> with a dry dick. Yeah, do you think Drake? I ain't gonna lie, Drake does definitely get his dick control. Control, nah, nah, control. There's no nah, way. Nigga, Drake definitely got some ass before you made that one. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. No, that nigga had that many hits. That's Look, Tory Lanez has been recently. I know he's fucking Twitch. in the studio. No, he he's recently live streaming on Twitch. Now he's independent. He can do whatever he wants. He's been streaming him making songs. He let the chat choose the song title, the beat, oh, yeah, and then he'll that. switch cameras and he'll he'll be in there and he'll start rapping. It'll be fantastic. That's, and I'm, it's not not gonna be Tory Lanez doing it. No. He's not knocking Tory Lane. Tory Lane's a very, very, very talented man. That brother ain't Drake, though. Drake has had so many hits that there's no way that nigga has not gotten his dick sucked in That's what I'm studio. saying. There's Tory no Lane's way. probably did. He didn't do it on Twitch. No, he didn't do it on Twitch. He didn't do it on Twitch. He's a nasty nigga. Studio. I know some rappers who's a lot lower than Drake who's getting dick sucked in the studio, so I know Drake getting funky in the studio. Yeah, he is. He probably getting double. Double glock. Then again, I don't think I don't know. Drake he probably got three heads down to Medusa. Stop. I ain't gonna lie. I think I think Drake. Uh, what the fuck? Yeah, Medusa's John, crazy. I ain't gonna stop. Lie. Huh? Like, he's a yeah. That's crazy. He's a what? He's a father. But before that, he was definitely good. I think <laughs> that Drake gave me the vibes like he be in the studio with like candles lit. You think you think he's that <laughs> king? Bro, he his like candles lit. Look at those text messages. Facts. Find shit to say. He he rapped about it damn near. He and he has writers. A studio is not a clean place, bro. I'm not saying who cares. Like, girls, girls do a lot of funky shit. And a lot of he, got, like, like, bars. he could be in the studio like, um, this nigga literally had said a he long go, day. He gets clear my head just to clear my head. Okay, all right. <laughs> she came in like, to clear my so head. Bro, to clear this my nigga head. Literally rapped about how Chubbs goes gets him women and bring him back. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, come on, like Chubbs. we gonna act as if like this nigga. No, nah, Chubbs is like his. Sorcerer. I know that's his, that's his man. So I get Drake that. Drake don't even need a sorcerer. He just needs to organize them. They probably he, 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 probably he, 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 need, he needs to organize. If I was organizing Drake's bitches, that's a big job. But he has an organizer and a filter. That's what he needs. <laughs> you know what you want? You want to be I really drive a bus. Then be Drake's bitch organizer. All the bitches I gotta organize. John is best top writing novels on how they gonna do it. I've never seen dick suck like that in a long time. But can you imagine how many hoes Chubbs has? Chubbs has a lot of bitches. For for being for being Drake, gotta go through a read to see if they reach the qualifications. I wonder what the qualifications are though. Nothing. Hey, let me shut up, bro. When I actually know this nigga, bro, nothing. I ain't gonna lie to you. Drake's baby mother is. Not what Drake and Mother's supposed to be. That was that. All right, chill out. Let's chill out for a second. Let's calm up. We started talking yeah, about I'm not, the I'm day stop. But I'm, but I'm saying, <laughs> um, what I'm saying is, it has to be, it has to be some level of, of yeah. Just be, just don't say nothing afterwards. So just yeah. quiet. You don't see what I'm saying? Like, don't, don't speak on this afterwards. Man, Enjoy he gotta yourself. Have paperwork too. He got yeah, to have all the NDAs. Probably, you know what I'm saying? Uh, a signing NDA. Signing an NDA to suck dick is crazy. Nah, they all got to sign NDAs. They all do that. NDAs. We walk in the house. Who? Yeah. All celebrities, but you could do a certain level. Yeah, Chris oh, really? Brown, Chris Brown, Brown NDA. Chris Brown does have that. Chris Brown, when you walk into his house, he's NDA. He's an NDA. And in the bucket, you got to put all your phones in. You put your phone in there, yep. And the phones get locked up in the safe. Like fucking Sky Zone. Waivers. 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 That's really what it is. Yep. And then you get the waivers. No. Nope. And you get the stairs. Yeah. 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 You know you've been here. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And you got to get your wristband for if you fucking, you suck it, or you just chilling. Yeah. It's different wings of the, of the mansion you can stay on. If you ain't fucking, you can't come to this side. <laughs> Facts. You know what I'm saying? Nah. This is a chilling zone. But I feel like, you I feel like, I feel like you, are, if you're hey, a you know what I just seen today? Oh. Sorry to cut you off. Ahead, I seen Tyler Perry's new crib. This motherfucker, That's Tyler Perry, new, has two runways. Yeah, so he can park a plane directly at his crib. He has a plane and a helicopter, helicopter pad. He has two fucking runways and a big ass 
colonial looking house. How big is it? It is it's huge. huge. It's, it's built on it's, like a like hundred acres. It's supposedly bigger than um, Ross's house. It is Peru. huge. Well, I feel, Damn. Why does it? Why does the house not big? But if and I, it's off a cliff, like this is looking over the top. This is why I love this Atlanta. Atlanta. This is why this I love Atlanta. Atlanta. Why does he need a house that's that a big? Black man. All his that's a black all man. That's a black man. With two runways. All his solid pair of production. Think about, that, think about Think about like how rich you had to be before you're like, but I don't even want to hit the airport. I want to go straight home. Let me build a couple of runways. How much money do you have to have to have a runway? I don't know if he has wife. He's lonely with all that house? Just him and Medea? I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. I mean, I was with you. I'm pretty. I know he just tripped. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he takes yes. he take care of officers. I know he's yeah, tricking. I'm pretty sure he. Does. I know top he a top trick in the world. Top. How, how you know that, brother? He probably, we, we ain't seen with a woman yet. He just spending money on everybody. If you got an airplane jet, you probably tricking. It gotta be. There's no way you spend money for yourself. I mean, who knows? For yourself, he, he got in shape out of nowhere too. Yeah, for some hoes. Or for but self growth. If I have a self growth, way, but, 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 I mean, he, does, he does have a child. He has a child. If he I have a runway in my house, I should never have to beat my meat. I feel, I feel like he likes women. prohibited. Why did hey your brain, John? We gotta look into that. Why is that the first thing you thought of? Because you just talking. We just you gonna you just talking private about, jet no, no, fifty thousand dollars in flight. You gonna fly in about. pussy every time for sure. You get flown in straight not, to me. I am not. I ain't gonna lie to you. Okay, airport. I, if I'm I have like, two runways, I'm at that point in my life. I will never be alone. I will yes. pay for women to be around me. That's a house. I would have we're going to put it on me. the screen too. Forever. Jesus. They would just, they just want to be around me. This is a castle. Imagine being here by yes. That's why I don't like houses. Like, I'm too scared to be by myself. Throw it. I want to throw it, bro. It's on my phone. I got it. I'm going to catch it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can do that a little too loosely. Damn. Damn. <laughs> he can do that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> no, he can do that a little too loosely. Yeah, that, but that, that house, he's been building a house for like the past like year and a half. That's that crazy. Wow. Because the old house, I don't know if you know the old house he's been in. Matter of fact, I know one of his houses. Isn't it a studio? Wait, like, like the house from uh, yeah. Okay, right? No, it's in Kennesaw. That's like the house from Hunter x Hunter. That's a fact, you do. You do? The uh, you King. King. The, the Camera Ant King house. Yeah. Anime house Miriam You don't watch anime either? No I watch Damn. anime but not not Hunter Hunter. You, you, you say people watch anime are depressed Gotta no, tap in my boy Gotta tap in 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 Okay All Not right. but I'm about to watch that new uh, <laughs> That new uh, goddamn Obi-Wan Kenobi though Facts the Star Wars? I saw cool. that. Yeah. I saw it on the Twitch ad actually. Oh, word. Obi Wan, the Star Wars shit. Oh, the the um his old house is the one that Steve Harvey bought. It's so if I'm almost everybody, if you ever looked at any type of like big houses on YouTube, you've seen the thumbnail. That's how big it is. It's identifiable. Wow. Like if I showed you the picture of it, you'll be like, oh, that's his house. Sure, and sure. he sold it to Steve Harvey though. Steve Harvey. These black men are getting money. Yeah, no, they really are. Man. It's not too far from where the um um OMP house is at. Interesting. Mm. Like, you heard about the story with Prince? He was renting oh, some basketball player house. Oh, it's on the road. With um, huh? Carlos Boozer. Same yeah. road? Yeah. Not, not he had money. that road, but the main road to get on that road. road. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> Mad different conversations. I mean, I thought we were talking about houses. You talking about Prince? You talking about nah? Prince is rich. No, we were talking about uh, Prince was rich. Uh, well, you talking about Carlos Boozer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a crazy story for a year, and then brought it back to normal. Who? No, the best part because yeah, no, he gave him five hundred yeah, 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 yeah. thousand just to, to ease, ease his, his mind. mind. He just wired him because yeah. he said like I yeah. guess Carlos Boozer he was playing for the Jazz and he um he had bought a house in L.A. I guess and I guess his realtor kept calling him like hey this guy wants to rent your house out he's gonna pay you ninety thousand dollars a month he's like shit all right so I guess he had to he tore, he tore his ACL or something or his meniscus or something. He yeah, to he, LA. Said he didn't want to rent it out at first. Until yeah, he, 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 he want to rent it out at all. And then he said ninety thousand. He's like, nah, rent that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? That's money. Oh, yeah, yeah. So he said he went back to LA for um physical therapy, and uh he went to go to the house to get some stuff. And he's calling Prince like, yo, but Prince not answering. Prince is in Asia on tour, and then when he goes to the house. His whole house is different. Like the statues are gone. The the inside yeah what's what's everything what's up, what's up with this guy? Like, is is, is low pulling uh, Rick Ross right now? What are you doing? <laughs> you know, you know Rick Ross went to the podcast um, and he got to use the bathroom never came back? <laughs> never heard that no. story? No, no, I never heard that. Rick Ross did a podcast and he got to use the bathroom real quick. Went to the bathroom never came back. No, or a Paul Pierce. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga's on my dick. This nigga's on my dick. Man, yeah, the oh, prince man. is very rich. And like he um, sent him like $500,000. Like, oh, you know, before I move out, it's going to be back to normal. But here's this to ease your mind. And he stayed in the house for like a year and then like... They came to the house like, he, like, he, like when, when he moved out and everything was like how it was before. Wow. And he said that Prince has too much money. Like he's just doing shit like that. Like way too much money. Way too much. It's money. something in my throat. Like, like I that's... 
when I yawn, it, something kind of got. You have a it's big flimmy. ass jaw, man. You gotta close some your lard, jaw. There's some large in there. Yeah, I, th- I thought you said lard. That would have been crazy. That was no crazy. large. Lodged. Lodged. So Lodged. Shaq, what do you say? What's the top five thing? What's the top five things you look for in a woman? In a woman, yeah. um, sense of humor. Hold on, um, let me get the notes. We 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 carry. We can keep it right here. All right, so right. Um, ready. Sense of humor. Uh, damn. It's not. I don't really be damn sense of humor. They gotta be like. I don't like tall women like that. Cause like tall women are too. They want to battle all the time. So middle school height. Nah, middle school is crazy. <laughs> you say you don't like tall women. What height range? Like oh five, 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 oh five, six. God. <laughs> middle school height is outrageous. <laughs> we need viral clips. No, no, no we don't. No, no. Dude, we're, not, no. we're not going nigga, viral with me. Don't say just yeah. try to get viral. No, nigga. No, no, no. no. <laughs> middle school height is crazy. It's, like, nothing's wrong with tall women. I had tall women in my life before, but it's always a constant battle. Like, not even that they're as strong as me because they're as tall as I am. But like my height limit is like five nine. How tall are you? Six one. So like if a girl's like Who are you six dating? Four, WM, I, no, no, not dating, but like, you know, when you when you're like with somebody, if they like your height, they're gonna try you. Really? Yeah, they're gonna like push you and they wanna play fight all day. When they play fight, it kinda hurts. Cause they they kinda <laughs> they be, they be kinda strong. There's no there's no girl who's there's no girl who's six foot who's weak. If you're six foot, you're gonna be strong some way somehow. Yeah. They they kick really hard. Or, they're very strong and independent. They're very strong and independent. Oh my god! Very bigger knuckles than a five five woman. So you like them weak and dependent? Nah, not weak and dependent. I just like them. <laughs> yeah, I like, I like, I like, I like independent. It's crazy. Like I like like five 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 six average height. Mm. All right, you know what I'm saying. Mm. Uh, so yeah. this sense of humor, you know, the height thing. But I don't discriminate. If you're tall, still still get my DMs. I, I climb trees. I guess. Um, he climb trees. Yeah, I like I like uh, emotional intelligence on your end also. Like I want you to know what your emotions are like. I don't want you to come to me trying to figure it out. Mm. So emotionally strong. Yeah, emotionally strong. Emotional strength. Emotional yeah, strength. yeah, yeah. But even if you don't have that, we gonna still figure it out. Um, I like for your finances to be in order, like mm. financially responsible. Okay. Like you're not just like you're not making a thousand dollars and spending a hundred dollars the next day. Yeah. Like you make a thousand dollars, you're gonna wait till you make at least like a couple more thousand dollars before you go buy something. Yeah, for sure. You know, have like a good career or something because I ain't, I ain't got a job. But um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's hard out here for a black man. Um, what else? Last Savage, uh, Savage told me that the other day too. I was like, what? He just I look, Savage like he was going through. He's like, man. <laughs> I'm trying to get like you, brother. I was like, "What you mean?" He's like, no, nah, trying to get like man, you is crazy. Hard. It's hard, man. I, and I and I looked at him. I was like, "Yeah, I know." Especially with housing, he's like, "Yup, yup, it is hard trying to try to move in somewhere, man. It's hard, man." I was like, "Fuck." No, nah, I ain't gonna lie. Walk around and put your head down is crazy. I don't do that. Nobody knows I have, I have no job. People think I'm rich, but um, now they know, huh? <laughs> man, yeah. yeah, they probably know, but they still go, they still go see me and think I'm rich. They always act for me. I feel sorry. I, like, I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> knew he was unemployed. I feel sorry for some of y'all youngins who ain't got it like figured out. Cause bro, them houses and shit is crazy. Bro. Housing's crazy. Just in case you thought you about to move out your mom crib, nah. They yeah, like, and so you got to move when you need the first month, last month, next month. Yeah, so ten months from now, rent all, crazy, all at one time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The, the first five months. First, first half of what you make in the month, and, and, you need, and, you need, and, and we need a deposit fee, and an eight hundred credit score, and a reference, and your bank statements. Mm. It's crazy. Oh, like, you need, need, you need, need black. We need a black fee. The good thing is my name sounds white. So while part of places they like Shaquille does not sound white. Shaquille's not my name. I was about to say, nigga, that's crazy. <laughs> my name's O'Neal. O'Neal Ashley. O'Neal does not sound O'Neil. white. O'Neal Ashley. O'Neil Ashley. I don't Ashley? know no white nigga's name. O'Neal Ashley. O'Neal Ashley. So they, they they think I'm a girl or a white boy. Always. O'Neal. And so they see me, they're like, "What the hell? Let me see your ID." I'm like, "Oh shit." Let me see your ID gets you. <laughs> like, oh, like, us too. They were like, we, we, we don't walk through a home, got approved, send the, it, send the ID in it. Like, ah, I ain't really feel no, no, Right now, off. like, literally, oh, right wow. now, I'm in between, like, getting to a new apartment. And I keep getting the line with next for the ID. Yeah. It's Atlanta, bro. That's get you, man. Every time. But yeah, the fifth one is just. You need to just mm-hmm. take a photo with, like, horrible lighting so you don't look black. And they're going to say, resend it. You resend it, yeah. <laughs> or use it. the uh, Kodak filter. Mm. I'm cold, but I'm white. See me, I'm white. Okay. <laughs> one, more, one more thing. One more thing. Um, just like family I oriented. I want kids when I get older. Family oriented, John. Yeah. That's the last one. Yeah, I'm getting family. to the age now where it's like I'm starting to think about family. Like yeah. I'm about to be 26. Yeah. I don't want to be 40 years old with a, with a toddler. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like, if you're 40, like you shouldn't be chasing after your two year old. That's crazy. 
They they, do, they out here though. No yeah, no, there's a lot of them out here, but I, I just can't do it. I want to be 40 years old and sure. like at Disney World, my like eight year old. And I could go, we could go play football and do some shit. I don't want to be four years old and I got here crying at three in the morning. You trying to play with your kid at 40? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I have like real, I want to be, I don't want to, I don't want to be too old. Like, imagine me at 50 years old and you got teachers on how to throw football yeah. and then you show them to play with the kids there. You, you can still do that though. You, you can, but it's like younger. The, the odds of me being 50 and in the best of my life to be able to be active with you every single day, yeah, I don't, don't want to be a crush. Mm. Like, I don't want to be a crush. Yeah. I don't want to be that dad where it's like, on Mondays, I can yeah. throw football with you, but by Wednesday, like I'm super tired. But if you, you just, don't want to short stick your son, yeah, you yeah get you're you going got. crazy over there. You all right, brother? Hear what this thing is? He said, saying? short stick your son, what? play with your kids. You all right? Well, you said you're all you kid. got. He's what just saying about? shit, and y'all, y'all, the conversation is oh, going. Nah, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm hearing yeah. it. But I'm trying to just go over it. So you want to be you be forty playing with your kids, right? Shorts, you don't you want to short stick them. Give them all you got. He just you don't want to be old and not be able to give your kid. The life other kids get. Think about you. Ah, I, I can't. I can't throw the football with my son. I'm 58. <laughs> well, first of all, if you're in if you're in good shape, like you're gonna be fine until you're yeah. like 70. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not in good shape now. Yeah, <laughs> so it's not looking that good. You can work on that though. <laughs> no, I'm trying, but you know, life is just. So you got it five, right? Yeah, yeah, I got. Uh, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, make sure. You know. hey, what's your horniest moment, man? My horniest moment. I'm always horny though. Interesting. Nick, what? I right promise now? you, it's like it's like, right it's like you know how you know how guys be saying, "Oh, I had a rover, but I couldn't get hard," or no. something like that. Like you I know, had a what? Like you know, like you know, guys be like, "I couldn't get hard, so I didn't do it," or they be like, oh, "I was too excited." I've, I've, I swear, I've only heard that twice in my life. Nah, I hear guys say all the time. They'll be like, "Oh, all the time, I was, nigga, I'll be ready." If girl could blink at me two times, I'm there. I'm a medium rare, ready to go. Let's do it. I've never heard that. Like, what's time. one story? Like, what's one moment? Oh, my that was like, time. It was probably in school. Like, you ever been to school and, like, you shouldn't be horny, but you're horny? Okay. Yeah. Like, 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 you're in math class. Yeah. And, like, you, your dick is just hard. For no or reason. For no reason. And you get called up and you got to, like, try to, like, mm-hmm. bend it a certain way so that they don't poke through your jeans. Mm-hmm. That's my horniest moment. Like, just being in math class and they're talking about, like, addition. I'm, my dick is just on hard. Mm-hmm. And I'm not thinking about nothing. Mm. Like I'm just horny For no apparent reason Like I gotta stand up And my dick is on hard Well did you decide To take care of it though? Nah I, I never I don't do something Like that in public Oh he He uh Why does he keep lying? Just stop lying Cause people actually Believe your lies No I said I said uh, I was just horny In a computer science class Same story But then by the time I, I asked teacher Can I go to the bathroom When I got up I immediately like Lost interest oh, Like yeah. the reality hit me I was like <laughs> <laughs> look at look at me. Yeah. Look at you. <laughs> look at you, nigga. Gonna go in this bathroom and start beating off, nigga. I mean, look look how low you have come, nigga. No, so I just beating off in the high school bathroom was outrageous. Oh, I I knew somebody who beat up in the middle school bathroom. Middle school bathrooms. It was John. No, no, no. I, no, I, went, I was in school and the dude was like beating <laughs> off. He, he he had he had a Tomb Raider <laughs> game informer and he was jacking off in no, class. I ain't gonna lie. She was She's she had bad, some bro. she had some nice titties. Yeah, what's up, what's up with these people who who be making these like these animes and stuff Let's like that? Who like, had they be like Laura Croft? Laura, Laura, was it Laura Croft? Yeah, Laura, yeah. Laura Croft. Who? Like, what, like, what's the up two, with these people? The lady who played Tomb Raider. Um, just double oh, checking. She oh, played. she's twenty six. Thank God. Yeah, she is beautiful. Oh yeah. my God, Laura Croft. Who she her age. I thought Laura Croft was a made Croft. up name. I mean, yeah, she's the been the Tomb Raider girl. Wait, the one for the real what, movie or the actual character of the game? I don't even know the movie. Talking about the game. You got to check these things with Ron John sometimes. You know what I'm saying? You gotta, well, you got to check the age of a That's what I'm saying. Why you the like, game? Yeah. Facts. What? All right. So, She's good question. Raider. What What cartoon character? Like Tomb Raider. It was just Tomb Raider? Or Catwoman. Catwoman. Who about you? Like, what, what, what cartoon character ever made you like, damn, how did you look up her fucking birthday? Isn't on, brother, she on, is stunning. Um, stay focused. Stay focused. I wonder what Dora looks know. like now. That's crazy. You're going straight to hell. You think Dora bad as fuck now? Hell going to be hot when you get there, too. You know that, right? You think, I, think, I don't I'm think saying, Dora ages. Dora's always gonna be a little kid. You know that, right? So you know what's crazy about Dora? She's always to be now. Dora has some bad parents, though. John, what's wrong with you? She, like Dora should be about twenty-seven, right? Oh my god! I was watching Dora as a kid. As you were saying, she has awful parents. Awful parents. Kind of like um, Ash Dora should from be Pokemon. Grown. Yeah, horrible parents. Like, letting freaking kids just roam the world with animals. Yeah, and like <laughs> she knew that there was like a fox out there oh, trying to hunt. You know who probably sexy as fuck. Ni Hao Kailan. Who? Remember her? Yo, hell gonna be super hot when Who you was get there. Who was that? Ni Hao Kailan. You remember Ni Hao Kailan? She was a cartoon way back in the day. She probably bad at fuck now. Yeah, she probably know. a streamer. If she was real. <laughs> she a streamer? 
I don't. I don't. I can't remember. I can't think of one right now. You too old, bro. A, a character or like you a cartoon character? Came or just out. anybody who played anything? A cartoon character. Oh yeah, I don't know. I, don't know. I, think, I think like Shigo. You remember Shigo? Who? Shigo was, from Danny, from Danny Phantom. The girl. The girl. No, the girl not, goes. Kim Possible. Oh, Kim oh. Possible. I'm drunk. Kim she Possible goes. bad. Kim Possible bad too. Because Kim, Kim Possible had the jeans, the low waisted jeans. No. I love what girls wear low waisted jeans. What's the girl from the Proud Family? Penny. Oh, oh, Penny? She should be old now too. Oh, Why are you keep naming under eight? Well, to me, <laughs> I'm saying now. I'm saying it should to be, be older. Fair, Kim Possible was also under age. Just FYI, she go was not in school, so I, yeah, I assume she that she was a, a rebel. She was a villain. I loved it about her. <sighs> What's her you, name? You, Penny you, Proud. I just said that. Oh, and also, you're probably you're, like, and also you're, 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 probably not, you're not only naming. <laughs> she probably got a kid by now. <laughs> not only are you not naming like underage women, but you're naming like middle school women. Why do you keep doing? I'm that? saying when they get older. Yeah, you in middle school, oh, I, but you don't know what she looks like when she's older, though. I'm saying she should be. All right, all right. Now that the we, only the only woman I know that, that played that. a role and when she got older looked great was um, uh, my wife and kids, the the young daughter. Those are real people. I'm talking nah, about she's cartoons, fire enough. Though. Yeah, she's fire enough. But well. I don't. But I don't know. I didn't. I, I didn't think that way about cartoons. I really didn't. And I watch a lot. I'm of just cartoons. thinking about it now. I was horny from my wife and kids. Which one are you talking about? <sighs> the youngest one. Oh, the little one. She's like your age, actually. So, Shaq, what's your uh, what's your biggest simp moment? My what moment? Simp. Simp. Mm. I have a lot of simp moments because, like, it's classified. Like, the stuff I be doing, people think that it's always simp. I be like, I don't really care. It so is. it's like, you know, what I'm saying, kind of girls like, oh yeah, you're simping. I'm like, I don't care. The girls love me, so I'm simping because the girls love me. And you, oh, me but a- do they respond? They give you interest back? Yeah, I be crushing oh, them. That's not really. That's not really interest. That's not simping then. But even even so, it's like it's it's still like categorized simp because I'm going to do everything that guys are not going to do because they don't want to be called a simp. So what is it? What's what's the most? Like, I'm going to show a lot of love. I'm going to be texting and calling. I will give a girl flowers. I will take them out. I will court them. Oh no! Are you in a relationship with this woman? No. Wow. I'm just a loving person. I like to spread love. So how wait how how long have you been like talking and texting somebody before you actually fuck? It depends. It's, it all varies like woman to woman. What was the longest though? The longest was my um like a year. I'm patient But I was fucking girls In between the year But with that one girl It was like a year hmm. But like You know what I'm saying But some girls It'd be a week Some girls would be like a month I'm very I'm a very patient person Well week isn't that Week isn't that crazy No week is crazy A month is You, you, you pushing it Yeah a month is pushing it But it's like Sometimes you gotta like It, it also depends on what I'm seeing them too How do you decide Whether or not it's worth waiting Um It depends on how good The interaction is Like if we're interacting Really well I could feel like, and how good they look too. Like if they're bad, mm-hmm. I'm gonna wait because I know like I'm gonna do you something bad when I get my hands on you. And I tell them that too from general. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. When I get my hands on you, I'm gonna do you something bad. When I get my hands on you, I'm gonna do you something bad. <laughs> but do you something? Do you the worst way? Like I'm gonna put you. I'm gonna put your head through the drywall. The longer and that, that gets them. Yeah, cause they do the longer. The longer I wait, when I get to you. It's gonna be. I'm going. Cause I'm gonna have build up anger from waiting for so long. What? Not anger in a bad way. Though. Not See, anger. That's why, that's, that's why I didn't give up. Nah, not anger like I'm I gonna give it a week. But anger like you've been playing with me for so long. Now I'm going to pop a honey, and I'm going to be drilling you for two hours nonstop, so you can memorize that this is you shouldn't don't wait no more. I'll give it a week. This is a horny and a half. Probably never that, had. Horny. We can have you off that. But I don't even need that much time. Not yet. You know, we, How much time you be having before you fuck? If the situation right, the setting right, same night. Like the same night. If I don't have nowhere to go that night, I'm just saying. Or, but the on average, uh, if I see that person probably one or two days. Yeah, one to one to three business days. On but average, but, average. I could do it faster if I really want it, but I don't care as much. <laughs> and like, also, when you meet too much, is bad. Like, yeah, shut. No, like we. It's like yeah, but you yeah. don't care. Yeah, you don't gotta care. But it depends on how I meet I'm you focused, too. I'm focusing on this paper right now. Yeah, if I, if paper, I meet you, if I meet you, paper, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, if I if I meet you in real life, it's the, the timeline is decreased. Like if I met you through social media, I it probably take more time because like we didn't I mean, meet yeah, up yet. Sure. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But if I met you, like if we if I met you in a club or you know in a setting, like you know, your friends brought you or some shit, I'm on. I'm spending my best game when I first meet you, so I could really have you. So it might not take that long. I might see you again a couple of days later. I think I think it takes like three times to see in a person. So you've never been, you never like did a whole bunch of shit for a woman and, and not you, got nothing and never got out yet. Yeah. What's the most you done? Like most um, you done, you never got anything. 
Probably took a girl on a date. Monetary wise, I don't know how much the dollar amount would be, just because it was so long ago. But I spent a lot of time and energy, and ain't get shit. But with me, it's like, well, if I don't get nothing, I don't care because like I'm going to it knowing that either I either could get somewhere, or I don't. Know. Well, what did you spend time on? Just healing. No, okay. That's always well, you know just healing. Like, that's after. I'm saying like during. Like, what were you spending time on? Oh, with with, with the person? Yeah. Just 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 regular shit. Like just spending time with them, listen to they, all their damn problems, and just. <laughs> Just I ain't gonna lie, bro. I ain't, I'm gonna do some keep it. This is a toxic set. This is toxic. I'm gonna keep it a be with y'all niggas. If I ever care about somebody else's feelings, bro, know that I genuinely give a fuck because there's too many other times that people try to like express themselves. Yeah. And I just don't give a fuck about yeah. what you're going through. No cap, bro. I do not have the emotional capacity to give a fuck about some random person. But bro. that's good to say. Though. At least you, 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 you know in your mind that you don't have the emotional. I do though. I think I have too much. I know you because do. I, 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 know, I, know, I really, I really do. Will sit there and just listen, and I really have the best answer to get back to you. Oh no, I don't care that much. And that's why. That's why. I know. <laughs> I don't. I, like, I don't, don't know. I, can't, I, can't. I don't know how or why I have it. I think it's just because I've been with women so much for like so long. But I was. No, nah, I can't do it. Yeah, you get it from experiences. Yeah, so like I just I don't know, but like I waste my time a lot of times, but I still I still do the same thing over and over again. I don't care. What? Yeah, it's like because at the end of the day, I think it's just it's just me. Like me as a person, like I won't ever change who I am. I'm always gonna have the same approach. I'm always gonna. I mean, it evolves as I get older, but like I don't. I don't Why really not change like it. take that same time? Yeah, that's in myself. Yeah, I do. You can't. It's only twenty four hours in a day. <laughs> How much you think I'm talking to them all day? So no, no, but no, but the time in the day in which you're talking to them, you could be putting <laughs> into, into myself. Yourself. Yeah. yeah, I do put a lot of time myself. That's why I'm so. That's I'm not so, saying. I didn't say you didn't put a lot nah, of time. I, don't, I know. I know. Okay, but I'm saying. I'm like, say, I'm put saying like, saying. I, I put a lot of time myself. Like I spend. Yeah, think about it. I grew up by myself. No cousins. No. So a lot of my time, like I was me chiseling my brain to be like I was. I did really well in school. You know, I'm very social. I know how to talk to people. I know how to pull on different hats. Are you playing games over there? Uh, no, I was texting someone back. I was, there. Get, being, I, I was doing what you said. <laughs> I was being there for them. It's following your advice. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, see, yeah. You're learning. At their time yeah. of need. But yeah, I spend a lot of time on myself. That's why I, like, I don't know. That's why I've been in a lot, a lot of rooms I've been in, you know? I feel, like, I feel like if I haven't spent time on myself, I wouldn't be here. There's some truth to that. I hope. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I, I know, I know exactly what, what you're saying. saying. Like, like, exactly like think about it. Like, to me personally, I've always said this on record. I think I'm the biggest small creator on YouTube. If I just I think about it, like, like, like for, for the, the sub count that I have, the uh-huh. things and what I've done on the, the platform is at such a high level that it would, like, people think I have a lot of subscribers. Mm. They're like, oh my God, where are you right now? I'm at 7K. They'd be like, what? What? Mm. But I've been on a lot of big videos on podcasts. Like I'm doing things that big, big. Are you YouTubers been on Smashing Pass videos? Yeah. Okay. I've done it all. Yeah. On YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Like the 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 amount of views I've gotten in videos. That's why I started doing my own YouTube. But the translation, I'm trying to figure out how to make it translate, make it make sense. Wait, are those real though? The Smashing Pass videos? Yeah, they really be getting smashed afterwards. Oh, no, they, I don't, people, I didn't, I didn't, what he was people, asking. People, people don't want to say it. They don't want to put it on record. But I'm here to tell you. These girls be getting smashed after those videos. Wow. You know, but you better tell me you're gonna smash me and I'm not gonna try to smash you afterwards. That's kinda crazy. That is crazy, actually. Yeah, like you're right, 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 right. It's pretty you obvious. Tell me. Yeah, you're not gonna yeah, tell you're me. Gonna tell, you're gonna tell me in front of a million people that you're gonna give me some pussy and I'm gonna after the video. Try. All right, bye guys. No! <laughs> you say you would fuck me. What are we doing after this? Now so obviously some girls are not getting fucked, but a lot of times the guys is trying to fuck some. The right guys, you know what I'm saying? The the guys who know how to Talk to girls yeah. When that shit over with Yo you bugging Come here Give me your phone real quick What you about to do after this You going to the B&B You know what I'm saying Cause yeah. you know Most most best videos Are like oh, Atlanta Miami New York They yeah. be in like hot cities So people fly in And the models be coming And you're like yeah So, so, so. You, well, you teleport Yo Caleb's here So we want to wrap up Wrap up the podcast Yo um, We thank y'all For listening to another episode Of Peer Peer Podcast Any final Any final thoughts yet Nah it's just, I'm happy to be here you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm excited to see what uh, the future holds for both for the for the podcast and for you guys. You know, I, I watch your stuff. I watch your stuff on TikTok with your, your basketball takes. I don't agree all the time, but um, oh, how? How do you see my shit on TikTok? Listen, I, I, I I'm tuned into all that stuff. I see no, your stuff. No, but I don't upload on TikTok. No, I be seeing like you on other 
on other like um the little basketball podcast talks and stuff. I've seen you as guests on like with oh, the like with the Shaq the Shaq guy and the oh yeah, yeah players. You know what I'm saying? So I be I, I, I'm tuned yeah. in. Shout I be, out to I be, you know, I, I watch, I've been watching Agent for the last like few years or whatever it might be. Oh, thanks, man. And I feel like another thing is for the people out here who's watching is like manifestation is real, right? Mm. So I feel like you have to be, able, but you have to really see yourself there because all the YouTubers that I'm around, mm. I used to watch. Mm-hmm. Before like, I used to watch Agent Duke, a lot of big YouTubers, and I'd be like, I could be there. Yeah, like you can't, you ain't gonna tell me that I can't be there. Wait, but how did like, you? Who did you know of us? Wally, of course. I met Wally last year during the Cross the Crate Challenge video. The remember, what? remember, we were across the crate when it's the what cross yeah, the crate. Yeah, well, who's who's? It was a one in the land, and that shit was like okay, a thousand mind. people I know outside. Exactly which one you want. Yeah, and then he yeah. pulled up, and I met him. And ever since then, we've been kicking it. And I'm ending with this story. I met Waleed, and then like, he, we met each other, and it's so crazy because like Waleed goes out a lot, but I was really broke when I met Waleed. But like, I'm so in my mind, like I know how like life works. Like you can't turn down opportunities. You know what I'm saying? So Waleed, like, yo, let's go. We're going out. I go outside with zero dollars. In hopes of figuring out when I get there. Luckily, well, it goes to places that's be free to get in. So I just go in, I'd be free, I'd be just chilling, I'd be kicking it. You want to drink? Nah, I'm not drinking today. You know what I'm saying? That kind of thing. But me and Willie got really close, and um, over the last few months, we got really close. And then he started just calling me up for different things, like, you know, if people need the extras yeah. or whatever. That's why I got into the boxing video. Yeah. And you kind of said that I was a, I was a, I was a terrible boxing coach. You were. Um, <laughs> I needed real advice. <laughs> you just throw over, <laughs> overhand punches. I was like, where did this come from? What the fuck? I told you to do uppercut. You did uppercut in the work. But, um. Yeah, he did actually. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So, even with the uh, the racing video and like different like A&P, different things. So, it's, it's it's been a blessing, you know, just being around and just, just hearing conversations and learning, you know, how to just be a good content creator and not just do dumb stuff on the internet. So, I feel like, you know, I'm excited to see what the future holds. You know what I'm saying? I think that it's going to be a good year for uh, everybody across the board. John's doing good things. You know what I'm saying? Caleb's doing good things. Me and Caleb had a lot of hard to hard talks the last couple of days. And yeah. it was even funnier. I don't think Dean realized how long I've been in this house. Hmm? I don't think you realize how long I've been here. I haven't been in this house a lot. Uh, he been, he been, he's been here. I've been here for like two weeks. No, I mean, I'm not, <laughs> and, I, and, uh, he is I oblivious know, to be being I don't, here. I don't, I don't know if this is another thing that we uploaded. Man, I, when I used to live here, well, he, used to do, he used to do the same thing when I was here. I would just be... In the house And it'd be a nigga Cause I used to live downstairs yeah. And I had to use his bathroom I will be sharing his bathroom With a nigga I've never seen in my life I was like Nigga like Who it's the a- fuck is in this house bro I go in the goddamn um, laundry room I'm like These ain't Dean's Normally he's close What the fuck is going on <laughs> it's so Another cr- nigga crazy. laundry getting done Another nigga milk in the refrigerator I'm like nigga Who the fuck <laughs> lives here bro Who lives in this fucking house It's so crazy It's like Cause I'm in between Finally I'm trying I'm keep getting denied or whatever But I've been just staying in the, in the guest room, and like Caleb knows, and Waleed knows, and we every day you like, you think you think Dean knows yet? You think he realized? He was like, I don't, I don't know. He's like, I don't think he cares. He's like, no, nah, I, I don't think he knows. So every time I see Dean, Dean, like I'll be sitting downstairs in the uh, in the theater room, and he'll walk past the door. He'll be like, and then you just keep walking. I'm like, I bet I'm still good for another day. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, I bet I'm good, but I'm not a messy person. Or I'm not a loud person either. So it's like. I clean up, I clean, you know what I'm saying? So, like, it's easy to not have 10 minutes on my hair. So, it's just a blessing. But that's another thing where it goes to, like, just being who you are. Like, I'm a person where it's like, people, it's hard to hate me. So, it's like, for you to be like, oh, I, yo. Yo, John, I, what I hate- John was that nigga when I was here one time. With John? Yeah, John was huh? in the house one day. I, was, like, I, wasn't, I didn't have clothes here. <laughs> no, you didn't. No, you didn't. I just, I don't got clothes here. Was that, was that I, 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 never had a, I got a small bag. <laughs> I don't drink milk either. I don't drink milk. I think it was Humdu who was here who was just like every day. I like probably. And I just even I was like, I guess this nigga's nah, just here. Nah, it wasn't him. He this nigga had he used to work at Walmart? Nah. I was just he used to be bitches. a nigga Walmart's thing in the on the um That's Vortex. No, 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 no. It was somebody who was here, normal, like regularly. Their toothbrushes right there, everything. Oh, that's crazy. I was like, how am I sharing a sink with a nigga? What's I going go, on? I right go, I a toothbrush in a sink is crazy. I had a home. I was just fucking bitches. Which is fuck. Huh? That's even that's worse. Fuck. That's crazy. See, he used to just come here, fuck, and then go back home. That's what he's just saying. Now I'm, I'm, I'm like a ghost. Also, angle my. It was a few times I came upstairs and I just saw Savage in, in his boxers. I was like, nigga, <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> I saw Savage in his boxers. I was like, nigga, what is going on? When did you Whoa. see that? I seen Tara seen Savage in his boxers. What? What was this? That's crazy. 
<laughs> Sierra <laughs> came upstairs one time and came in downstairs. She's like, "This is a shirtless nigga upstairs." <laughs> I was like, "What? What the fuck?" He's like, "Oh, is it Waleed?" He's like, "No, no, no. It's not Waleed or Dean. It's just some random." And I came up there. I was like, "You like, yo, what up?" Oh, that, that sounds exactly <laughs> what he did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What up? That's crazy. We came here. There was a dog in the garage. I do remember that. What? And it pissed. Oh, it was a dog. Yeah. Who dog was it? I forgot. Someone dropped Black. the dog off. I forgot who it was. Black Black dog. Yeah. He was transporting it. Yeah. The pure what? Black. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I'm talking about that. I slept in the room that night, and apparently Waleed had gave him that room. So I wake up in the middle of the night, and somebody opening the door to jiggling. And like some random dude just walking in, like <laughs> I'm like in my box and sleeping. No, <laughs> see, see, it's so you tough. guys sleep together. Good thing you weren't doing nothing naughty. Yeah, good thing. Okay. Bro. But yeah, this is it's a blessing. This is a blessing. Just friendships are a blessing, and just being a good person is a blessing. Because he and I have been here for like eleven days, twelve days. I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel like, I feel like if he knew I was here, he probably didn't care either. He might. I mean, not, 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 he, he, he doesn't care. I charge yeah. Waleed the rent. Yeah. Yeah, so we Wait. should. Why would we think? Why didn't think of that was here? And I really should. Yeah, we just should charge Willie. No cap. Yeah, no cap. Especially when he doesn't. Especially when he doesn't even like confirm it or verify with nobody. Is just another nigga walking around with milk in the damn refrigerator. Nah, see, I ain't I don't do that though. No, no, I'm, 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 I made sure I gotta figure who that was, and it wasn't like I was mad. It was just I like I there was another nigga in this house, and I don't know. You know to pay rent? Yeah. When? Hmm? When? When? When I was I here? Was, Oh no no, Bruce! I talked to you. I told you. You said no. You waited too long though. Oh yeah, I knew. Caleb, Caleb, I, was, Caleb I, was yeah. 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 I wasn't ready before. Yeah, I was ready to go. I was ready to go. I ain't been up there for three weeks. Like I, I will pay though. You need me to me. <laughs> Bruh, I'm I'm so, 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 I would. Like, see, I'm a person like I had to be ready. Like I would work. I would work to live. So like I would always, I always pay my dues. So like I, when the garbage is in, the, if garbage is in the garage, when it disappears, I'm going to go all the garbage in the boxes. Yeah, I really like, thought I'm it was lead, man. It was me. Like I'm, I'm going to make sure that at well, least you told me it was him though. Yeah, Will he be lying? <laughs> <laughs> but look, but look like <laughs> yeah, Will he be lying? But I make sure that like my presence is so unknown that like if we find my presence here, it's like damn, that's a, that's a good thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, you, I don't mind that. When I was here, I didn't mind that the people who are, who were here that I didn't know they were here. Yeah. But no, nah, when I came in the bathtub, I was like, it's a it's a nigga soap in the bathtub. Yeah, toothbrush is crazy. It's a toothbrush yeah, soap in is here. I I opened a the thing. There's a whole nigga um badge. Oh, it might not be a Walmart badge. It might be like a nursing badge or something like that. I was like, nigga. that's crazy. So, yeah. Crazy. So, but hey, man, thanks for coming on the podcast, Shaq. Appreciate you guys. Um, appreciate you guys. Any any in front of words, agent? Um. Uh, God damn it! I'm gonna go with the Warriors winning the championship. You think so? Yeah, they probably are. They, they, they have the best offense left in the NBA. Caleb so. said he called it. No, he didn't. Uh, John, I called it. I might put ten thousand. I might put ten thousand hmm? on the Warriors. Hold on, hold on. Let me depending think. on how, depending on how favorite they are. Yeah, check the odds. If they have the odds is like. A, like minus three hundred. Literally nice. can't bet in Georgia. By the way, yeah. it's, it's, it's loopholes. <laughs> We're in Mexico. Yeah. You know you want to say something? No, I was thinking, nigga. Give him some time. Yeah, nigga, give me some Find time. out. You have the next know. episode of Peter Pan. Patient Pear. niggas. Like me just, too. It's the worst. You, you have to. Well, for me come to on. say what I was gonna say. Depend. That's what I'm gonna say. Patience is a virtue. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Fuck, all, nigga. I, all I will say is, yo, thank y'all for wa- coming by, watching another episode of Peter <laughs> Podcast. Make sure y'all click all the links in the description. Make sure y'all raise a five star on audio if you if you have to listen to us. Make sure you go and click um not only not only the uh, other channel where we got the clipped up. Make sure we got some uncensored stuff. Definitely some stuff that got cut out in this episode that's over there. And, and um, also, as always, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can join. No, the gang, 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 gang. And uh, until next time, we'll see you all later. Peace. Peace. Peace.